Okay, you ready? And three. Oh, hold on. <clears throat> hold on. <laughs> Guys, welcome back into the channel for another episode of Sick Cast. <laughs> no, seriously, if y'all are new here or you didn't see the end of the last episode, I'm recovering from pneumonia. <laughs> So I'm gonna be a little wheezy. No, um, all jokes aside guys. I've been taking care of myself been drinking lots of liquids I have my antibiotics. I've gone to I went to their urgent care a couple days ago This is day eight and I feel recovered, but you know pneumonia likes to kind of Grab hold of you and stick with you for a little bit So I am coughing and a little bit more congested than normal just like an itty bitty bit um, so I really just want to appreciate like say thank you to all of the well wishes and everything over the past couple of days um, but I it's no secret haven't been able to record during this time like that's eight days that I haven't been able to record so you guys are pretty much like caught up with me or I'm caught up with you guys um, but I really didn't want to miss any days uploading for you guys and I feel well enough to sit down and record so I want you guys to know that I always prioritize my health above all as much as I hate to kind of like disappoint or not be able to upload what you guys are expecting, I obviously prioritize my health, but I want you guys to know that going forward recording today, I feel great. I feel fine. My voice and my little lungs are trying their best <laughs> to keep up with me, um, but I feel I feel ready to kind of get back into recording. So now that we got that housekeeping out of the way, welcome back in, you guys. If y'all are new here, awful start to come in on, but we are picking back up after Nanaki has gone through and found out that his father is in fact a warrior and a protector of the veil and so we just had an encounter with um the gi gi narak and he had asked for uh nanaki and also Aerith to follow him i believe he used a different term that i know we heard earlier that she was referred to but um yeah so we are diving deeper into these caves to see what else we're gonna find cloud also got an image of sephiroth and so he's also dedicated to going and finding out what is being stored uh, what else we can find in these caves i guess um but yeah that's pretty much it other than that i'm probably going to take a couple more breaks than normal um and average in this i have to kind of slow down like i said my lungs are trying to keep up with me so i'm trying not to speak as fast as i normally do but that's kind of hard for me to do <laughs> i talked about this before but video games are my comfort zone and so especially when i'm sick i want to be gaming but i recognize that i can't always do that and I need to fully slow down and I'm done being slowed down for the past eight days I'm ready to pick it back up and enjoy diving back into what this game has to offer so I hope you guys enjoy episode 20 20 episodes I'm interested to see if this ends up being more episodes than God of War that to this day is my longest series that I've done on well exclude like one-off game like if you counted all the last of us or all the walking deads they probably are more but single game wise that was the longest one i've ever done so i'm interested to see if this one goes past that um and like i always tell you guys before i'm not rushing anything i'm trying to take on all the side missions enjoy all of it which speaking of we need to explore all of cosmo canyon so i think what we'll do this chapter is probably um continue through this um underground system and then we'll try to go finish up everything that Cosmo Canyon has to offer and all the side missions and maybe go back to the gold saucer. I feel like the perfect thing to cure my sickness is some chocobo racing. <laughs> Y'all, I hope you enjoy this episode. It's damn good to be back. And yeah, I hope you guys enjoy. Let's follow him. Oh, see if we can talk Within to him. that these flesh is a tumult of emotion. See to it that Nanaki remains safe. Oh, ho, ho, ho. <laughs> Our world is filled with wonders. I bid you seek them out. Seek them out. Let's talk to these guys. We will escort fellow Bugenhagen back home. Okay. Take care, friends. Please do escort Please him. look after Nanaki for us. Blessings of the planet be upon you all. Hmm. You know, I didn't get to really like look at this whole area, but look at the blades that are just sticking out of the rubble. It's actually an impressive battlefield. It's wild. Okay, let's see what we've got. Ugh. Can anyone explain to me why we're even taking this detour? Anyone? 
You have a little faith. Some of us are on a mission to secure the material we need to, you know, save our homeland. How can you talk like that in a place like this? I'm scared of it in my wits here. I don't know. This gee dude's too nice to freak me out. He may act nice. He's but too who nice? Knows what he's planning. Yeah, no. Stay what? <gasps> oh my gosh. It's like crossing. Oh, it's like the fairy, the fairy man. Very. Is it the River Styx? The home of the Gee lies beyond. I don't trust it. Now Ooh. let us begin our journey. But I do like his voice. Not so fast. What's in it for us? Unless it's materia, you can count me out. It's like How foolish child. You mention materia. My people are also in search of it. Are they? <laughs> <laughs> How strange okay, you should mention right. materia. Why would his people be on the hunt for materia too? I guess power weapon. Yeah. Hmm. It's currency. <laughs> the whole boat rocks. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Not a key. I'd stay longer if I could, but I'll be back soon. I promise. So wait, we're going somewhere completely different. Maybe out of Cosmo Canyon entirely. Talk about sticks. Look at those legs, sir. You need to hit the leg, leg day. Souls. Wow. Oh yeah, another Maybe try travel system. With the rocking of the boat? I want to move less, not more. <laughs> Didn't seem to mind when you've jumped aboard. Well, only because he mentioned materia. Be quiet. The planet is listening. I love his voice. Oh. And what's wrong with that? Anything that reaches the planet's ears in due time reaches those of the Cetra. Cetra, right. Unfortunately, the Cetra are not a tolerant people. Excuse me, am I intolerant too? <laughs> I'm Cetra. He knew that when he looked at her. He knew she was Cetra. Didn't he? <laughs> oh. You are indeed one of them. By lineage alone. Oh, wow. That's true. You we know not of their history. That has been lost to time. Yeah, actually, I was going to say, maybe we don't really know about history? them. Consider your ignorance a blessing. The Cetra's past is fraught with horror and sorrow. They could have been brutal. You never know. I guess there is this like romanticism based off of them because you think of the ancients, the Cetra, you feel like they're, whoa, we're back with Zack. Um, so there I am okay. on the ground, Pigs. bleeding out, watching everything go dark, thinking this is it. This is how it ends. Yeah. Only it isn't. Suddenly the wind picks up out of nowhere. The it good fate. So hard, it feels like it's tearing my soul right out of my body. Thanks. They put out the fire. Hmm. Where I guess they Next just saved them. I know, I'm back in the orphanage. But nobody can tell me who found me or how I got there. It's a miracle. He had bigger plans. Sounds like what happened to me. Whole freaking army unloading on my position. Okay, so this is a little bit about his backstory, yeah. I'm feeling every single force. Oh, just shredding him. <gasps> but then the wind starts blowing. The dust, the fates, the destiny. One minute, I'm outnumbered. And the next, I'm alone. None hmm. of it makes any sense. Because they're needed to help save the planet, maybe. I somehow Th managed to beat the odds and wake up here. 
alone. Vix is looking like he got an upgrade. I don't know what happened between one and two, Why but uh. Did fate pick me. Can't think that way. <laughs> Can't not think that way. Their luck runs out, but mine doesn't. Mm. I'm the only one who gets a pass. <laughs> Especially, yeah. And now that it's just me, what am I supposed Wedge, to do? Wedge, Jesse. No? Honor their memory. Yeah, I get it. <sighs> hey, come with me. Sure, but why? Oh, we don't well, know why he has an X on his face. I don't know if we know why there's a scar on his face. Yeah, so fate maybe kept them alive because... Now that we know there's like good fates and bad fates, right? There's like a good and an evil almost dynamic happening. The good must be saving them because they know that they're needed for what's to come. To possibly save the planet. It's, there's still so much to understand. Okay, this was where... The pigs. He's looking good. Okay. I know with Zax, it's pretty linear, so I can just kind of follow so, him. So, how's Cloud holding up? Mako poisoning's done a real number on him. Doubt he's in for a speedy recovery either. Mm. But hey, hope springs eternal. Right. If he does recover, you can bet your ass he'll act like it was nothing. Shrug it off and <laughs> That's say he's true. been through ten times that shit. No Are we talking anymore. about the same cloud? Come on. The guy's desperate to prove himself. Not like he needs to. If everyone knows he's a oh, wow. badass. Look at this. Again. Picking up some work as a merc. A Zack of all trades. Zack of all trades? Because <laughs> one's not enough. <laughs> Think about it. Oh my gosh, that's awesome. On the plate, so this station holds a special place in our hearts. Oh, the train looks different. It looks nicer. If the trains aren't running, do you think we could get topside by walking along the tracks? Oh, that's an interesting thought. Yeah, the train, maybe the train always looked like that. Maybe I just forgot. Apparently, how am I supposed to take sector eight? If I can't bury myself in work. Mm. It's just one thing after another. How many parties? I mean, we can't take any more. Any more promises? promises made and kept. Wow. It's not looking good. Is this our punishment for using too much Mako? Yeah. Look at the rat. The endless. Oh, there you go. There you go. Get it, Mr. Scabbers. Get it. <laughs> this guy. A lot of good dates started. I heard the corkscrew tone. A lot of good dates. I love the purple get up. The hall purple. True? Have all the reactors stopped working? <gasps> oh. Was it Avalanche? Warning. Sorry. I'm trying to hear everybody's conversation. Get a load of this. <laughs> okay. Let's see. The destruction of Sector 7 was orchestrated by Shinra themselves. What? We oh, can't let those yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, this is good. Pigs must be putting Midgar that up. Fight back against our corporate oppressors by joining Avalanche. Seek us out at the lot off Petal Lane. Petal Lane. Wow, that's bold. Yep. These guys are setting a trap for themselves. Shinra will just roll in and round them all up. Doubt public security will even bother going through the motions. They're too busy. Easier just to shoot and skip the paperwork. Then oh. Anyone who goes is an idiot, I know. But idiots are what we need right now. Folks who'll risk it all. Wait, don't tell me you're going. The Ugh. things I do for friends. <laughs> Our purpose. I kinda wonder how that rift looks to all the folks topside. Yeah, that's true. Does it look any different from like any of the other areas that we've been to. All right, Biggs, take us there. Hey, you ever wondered about your purpose in life? What you're doing here? Sure, from time to time. All the time. Or all the time. 
Would never have guessed. Didn't used to, but things changed. It's our Went through a lot after I joined Shinra, like... Mako. A lot. I bet. I ask, because ever since I woke up, I've been wondering about what to do with all this time I've been given. Hmm. Or what time we have left before who knows what happens with that rift. You know, like, how can he make a difference with this second chance that he's been given? Absolutely. Hey, Biggs. You said before I ought to try picking up some work as a merc. Yeah. Because one's not enough. So who's the one? <laughs> Cloud. Cloud. He didn't tell you? Must not have wanted the competition. <laughs> when exactly did you meet Cloud? The day before we hit Reactor 1. So... Uh... How long ago was that again? <laughs> Weird. My internal clock's busted. Mm. Yeah, mine too. What's that about anyway? <laughs> That's Good weird. Question. Time is... Uh, if they can't answer that, isn't that kind of leaning towards the whole time warp? I don't know. The timeline's not adding up. And especially if they are making a point to mention that. Loveless. So, what do you think's gonna happen to our baby? Uh, I just wish we've seen that couple seen before. Hey, let's give them a name. We may uh, not know. Are you gonna spend your final day? Are you looking just for keep a living treat? like I always have? Hey, take one of those. This is horrible. I think I prefer being number two or three. Suits me much better. Yeah. Why like we all go the guy camping? who only has to worry about the how and doesn't have to decide on the what. A yes. Minor role? Exactly. I'm no hero. So how come I was the one who got saved? Because hmm. someone needs you. You and your can-do attitude. And who might that be? Uh. You were the guy with whoever Aerith, brought you back, right? I guess. And assuming oh, there it's... was someone, who could it have been? <laughs> That's a good question. That is a good question. Are we never gonna get to be grown-ups? Oh. Okay, so we're going over towards Aerith, then. It's so strange to see Aerith start robbing folks. Okay, now I am glad that they added somebody kind of saying that because I do feel like there'd be more chaos, maybe? Yeah, exactly. It's just up ahead. Keep your eyes peeled. Copy. Oh, bikes! But also, yeah, Aerith's place doesn't feel like Aerith's place. <gasps> Please tell me we get to use this bike. Ah, oh, no. Without all of the flowers and water and life. An empty lot. Oh, this is where the meeting place Nobody, is. Nobody, huh? No, there was a bike. There's no, somebody. So... Well, at least Shinra was a no-show too, right? Who's there? <laughs> Kyrie. Hmm? Huh. New recruit? New Merc. Uh, as if I'd ever join Avalanche. <laughs> I just came to see what kind of morons would fall for your dumbass propaganda, that's all. But I should have known. Nobody could be that stupid. <laughs> A bunch of people are gonna show up. Anyway, I'm out, losers. Hmm. <laughs> I told you I wasn't cut out for a leading role. And here I thought I might have been saved for a reason. Some higher purpose. Maybe you just haven't found it yet. Sorry for wasting your time. Oh. Oh, it's Marlene. Biggs! It's up to us to find our own purpose. I mean, who says it's got to be one way? Everyone's sitting back, acting like the world's doomed, but the future's not set in stone. Yes. We're not powerless. So long as we don't lose sight of what's important. You know, what matters most of all when the going gets tough. I don't know, hopes, dreams, maybe? Something like that. So long as we've got those. And hold on tight and never let go. Like this? Like, <laughs> like your life depends on it. <laughs> I like Zach's the attitude. Lucky to have you. 
It's a start. Hmm. Anyway, I gotta run. I'll be sure to pay a visit to Cloud when I get the chance. See ya. We need to check out Think what's behind what that I barrel. Said. Guess I should probably head home too. But what was that behind that? Hmm. Kyrie left something. Was that her bike, by the way? Okay, hold on. Home is the main scenario, but what is this? Kyrie forgot her backpack, which is filled with traveling supplies. Perhaps she hoped to join Avalanche after all. Let's be honest, she absolutely did. There's the poster right there. Yeah, she must have, but it's not to say that there might not be more later. Please tell me we get to use this later. Let's go see Marlene. Aww. Is there anything for us to explore over here? Mm -mm. It looks completely different. He was right here. He might as well have saw Cloud. I'm back. Welcome home. Welcome home. <laughs> Guess who I just saw? Biggs. Really? Oh, Biggs should have came and saw her. Said he visit too. Oh yay! <laughs> Did he say anything about Daddy or Tifa? Oh. No, oh, uh, sorry. Forgot to ask. Aww. <laughs> Zach, would you mind checking on Aerith for me? Sure. <laughs> I just love We're Marley. We're headed for the same place. You'll see your daddy and Tifa again. It's kind of morbid, right? Soon? If that's what she's referring to. Soon enough, Marlene. Soon enough. <sighs> The tear. This world doesn't feel real. Something feels so strange about it. Cloud. It's me. The wind. That was you, wasn't it? Hello in there. <laughs> she doesn't look like herself. She really does look like a shell, or a husk. Hmm. What? Interesting. What was another... I just don't know what to make of those segments with Zach. I still don't understand it enough. Village of the Gi. This is epic. This is we that yeah okay that makes sense so we have the gi um the gi attire for our chocobo I think that's the one that we had scooped still standing wow it's a lot of bone. Mm -hmm. Goodbye. Can he just poof away? Welcome. Oh. To the village of the Gi. That answers that. <laughs> just liked a little dramatic flair. The village of the Gi. The boats are so intricate, but yeah, look at all this bone. A lot of bones. There must be new items here too, maybe? <gasps> and somebody's new item. Hold on, Cloud. Aerith. Aerith! Ceremonial staff! No way. Aerith's wizard rod. Oh, but she has so many with this. Oh, but 105? A sacred staff used as part of a ritual prayer to the planet. Contra ward fill ATB charges within the ward to increase your allies' ATB? Holy cow. So worth it. Alright, we'll test it. Magic power up by 20. Increasing the amount of MP absorbed by Soul Drain. I like that. And fire damage up. 
Ooh, increases reprieve. I like reprieve. Yeah, that's awesome. That looks fantastic. Okay, I think I want to use Barrett, Aerith, and myself for fights. Or maybe I should keep using Nanaki. Let me see. Because we're back playing as Cloud. Let me go combat settings. Um, party number one is those three. So no, no, we're good. Plus we want to max both of those moves. Mega potions. Nice. I'm going to buy both. Both mega potions. What else? It sounds like a radio or something. It's kind of weird. Huh. Okay, we have an upgrade for myself and Barrett. Powerful Punisher. I should have unlocked that much earlier. All right, synergy damage up by 5%. I already have. Increases limit gauge charge rate by 5% after successfully blocking. Ahem. <clears throat> Maybe not. Increases max HP, I'm gonna do. Okay, and then we have Barret. There we go. Staggering charge increases overcharge reload when staggering enemies. Increases defense by 35%. Or 35, not 35%. That'd be broken. Okay, I'm gonna do staggering charge. I know I don't have to spend points either, but I did like that. Red? Does Red have any 10s? No, we need 15 points for Red. Tifa? Tifa has not been gaining anything. Welcome to our domain, children of the planet. <laughs> hmm. Y'all hear that just now? It was in your head. <laughs> our flesh is gone, oh. yet our spirits are condemned to linger. Wow. Outsiders such as we are unwelcome, forever denied the planet's embrace. <sighs> I feel for you. Can only imagine how tough that's been. My kin now dwell within these effigies. Hmm. I beseech you, lend them your ears. Long has it been since they have had an audience. And why has he entrusted us with this? <laughs> okay, I don't trust that. That's an evil laugh. I don't know. I don't know about that. Mm -mm. They're not bound to the planet, and so she rejects them. Because you have to come from the life stream to return to it. So what, what were they born means? of? These dudes can't die, right? <laughs> They're invincible! I'm not sure that's something to celebrate. Yeah. Being stuck as spirits with no hope of release sounds like a fate worse than death. As if you know anything about dying. Uh, I mean, that's just are you rude. Even really alive? <laughs> Another stuck spirit, perhaps? <laughs> we shall not rest till the materia is ours. Materia is ours. You and me both. What do they want the materia for, though? This is so interesting. We long to lay hands on the materia of something. Oh, from the cycle of life and death. Cast out from the cycle of life. This is what I'm saying. This is, um,. This is so much. It feels so much like uh, that part in Fable. There he is. Oh, she just automatically cast a spirit or a ward on herself. Okay, I'm not having a good time against these guys. Hold on. Let me go triple slash. I love like the music though in these sections. All right, get a Merit. Hey, hold on. Let me try the new ability. Let's do ATB ward on myself. Come on. Nice. Build up that ATB. Here we go. Let's do this one. So I ended up having to go back in the previous video. I had to go back through, and so I lost my level ups that I had then received. So I have to do the smackdown again. 
triple slash. Okay, the ward ATB is broken. What? That's amazing. What? I'm definitely sticking with Aerith for a while for the ATB ward. I think if anything, we should, um, hold on, high potion, everybody. We should, high potion, high potion. I love this music. Um, let's apply a quick cast for her. So let's go to Aerith and instead of arcane ward, I'm actually going to put on ATB ward. Yeah, I like that. a nice cadence to it as well oh my gosh my voice is wrecked guys maybe it was too soon to start recording with materia you mean materia of peace hmm could it actually be bring them alive or give them the ability to join the life stream perhaps it's a lot of bones okay. here we go this is so epic ow i get an atb one Ow. I forget how to fight with like all of these different people, so it's very different for me, you know? It's like a... Keep it together. It feels so strange to me. Let's do the smackdown on... Yeah, um, this guy. I got this. Get in the DB ward. Let's go ATB ward on Cloud. Hold on. Let's do Smackdown on. Oh, okay, but we we did master the. Okay, Aerith's almost out. Aerith is to stone. Aerith is stone. Barret stone. Wait, it's just me. Hold on. I should be able to have an item to bring one of them back, maybe? I don't know. I've never. I've never. Um... Petrification. Gold needle. Ow. Okay, she's back. That's it. One more shot. There we go. Let's go items. Uh gold needle. Let's use our grenade. Here you go. <laughs> I'm dying. The grenade. Okay, we're gonna firework. On it. Okay, Eric died. Uh, and I'm frozen, so that was not probably the best, uh, <laughs> best battle. Maybe I need to really work on this. Dang, that's such a, they're difficult, like they are. I can't even figure out the petrification. Is it just whenever they attack us? <sighs> yeah, it might be worth using a couple different characters. Like we might want to actually have Tifa. Let's go Cloud with it again. Ow! Hang back. See, they're vicious, pesky little guys. Triple slash them. Don't overdo it. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. Let's do SmackDown on him. Focus the rest. Nice, get him. Somebody's turning to stone, I think. Maybe not. Swords for storm. Nice. Okay, we just got one dead. One down, one down. Shake it out, shake it out, shake it out. Aerith now leveled up. There we go. That's much better. Wait for him to stop spinning. Focus stop. Getting skewered. Not ideal. Here, keep it together. So it's my turn? Soldrin or Storm? Get it, Aerith! Get it! Go on! <laughs> that was such a pitiful fight. 
Not my best fights at all. Oh my gosh, everybody's down bad. Okay, let me go Mega Potions. Mega Potion. Mega Potion Aerith. I need to start drinking more water. My voice is going. I need them to max their weapon, though. Let me see. Where are they at with it? Okay, just one more, and then they should do a level up right there. Yeah. I got it before we died, but I lost it in this one. Wait, what's up there? Materia. And that is Materia. You really think so? So an ultimate Materia? Where is it? You gotta tell me! In the Materia of Peace, we shall find the end for which we have long yearned. It is a little bit of, um, it is a little bit... It's not that they're trying to come back alive or kill anything. I think they're really just trying to find peace. But if they're an abomination to begin with or not from the live stream, then why should they return to the life stream and have that peace? I don't know, it's an interesting thought. Our ultimate salvation is cessation. It is nothingness. Our wish is not to exist. To no longer, yeah. To no longer exist. Reminds me of Lord of the Rings. The ultimate salvation is nothingness? Okay. In the purest of material. How would Sephiroth be tied to this? Maybe he wants this materia for himself as well? But if the materia lied within this chamber, then they would already have their hands on it, no? Maybe because they can't... They... Maybe they need, like, a human to pick it up? I don't know. This is strange. There's don't know about y'all, the key. But I got a sinking feeling. Think we probably don't want to overstay our welcome here. Think we already have. It's hard to feel at ease around folks whose only desire is death. And if the planet won't let them have it, well, who's to say they won't let the planet have it? <gasps> Save uh, me! <laughs> sure. Wait, Red Don't actually. Think someone responsible like me ought to hang on to that materia, so it doesn't fall into the wrong hands. I think we should be so involved responsible. at all, Lassie. Little late for that. <laughs> this whole atmosphere is amazing. What do you think he wants us to do for him? Touch the materia. He's gone. With pain and spite may lack the mud is steeped in our one desire. Curious to materia no more. With pain and spite may lack. Steeped in our one desire. Black materia. With pain and spite. Cloud, cloud, something's happening to him. <laughs> With pain and spite made black. Sephiroth absolutely would want that. No? Whatever that materia is, we can't let them have it. No matter how much they want it. Surely he's Not listening. We can let this go. But for now, we play along. He knows. An unquenchable thirst. This is such an epic area. Look at this. There are like gems that maybe it could have been carved from. Oh snap. The star we call home. The star we call home. Shattered. Few of my people survived the chaos and calamity. 
those who Okay, whoever is narrating this. Epic. The, my only my only thing is like I I hate it because you can't really focus on it because you're in the middle of a fight. Um it kinda like takes away from it. It's a bit unfortunate, like I want to be able to hear it. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Resurrection? What? Oh, I've never, um, I've never assessed them. That's a little silly. Fire. Oh, I can work around this. Oh. Oh my gosh, I'm so silly. I need the fire that bounces around to other people. Soldier. Hold on, I should have fire too. Fire level two on this guy. Before he can resurrect. Scare. Alright, keep tossing this guy up. Punch him up, beat him up. Get him. Let's do synergy ability. Firework blade. Beautiful. I'm gonna have to heal a ton though. Resurrection. Oh my gosh. Guys, I'm getting my butt handed to me. We are burning through mega potions. Mm. I'll go high potion on Aerith, high potion on Barret. I doubt he doesn't know that we plan to deceive him or use him. This feels like such a whoa. Even the carvings look like bones. Look at this. See, this feels very 16 to me, but probably because I'm thinking of like the chambers and stuff and that's what this whole area is. Those not born of the life stream can never join its flow. Yeah. One cannot return to that from which one did not arise. Makes sense. And so our souls sought refuge here. Yet idleness brought no solace. Our days, a penance imposed by the planet for the sin of our existence. But and who now, created them? Our only wish is to be freed from this prison, to be granted true release. But I don't know what the cost of that release would be. I don't trust it. Shrine to Oblivion. From the planet, we claim the greatest of materia, a most sacred treasure, and imbued it with our desire for freedom. I know this voice. Something from Mass Effect, maybe? No. After an eternity, the materia began to stir, and thus did we rejoice knowing that salvation was within our grasp. We rejoiced, so convinced were we that our prayers for release had not been in vain. Hmm. Unless something sought to use them through this. Create false hope. Yet the loathsome Cetra trespassed upon our lands and stole the treasure that would grant us deliverance. Mm. Therefore, we ask that you retrieve it. The Black Materia, key to our oblivion. Please, it alone can liberate us from this endless dream. The Gi cannot rest until our sacred treasure has been restored to us. Moreover, in redressing the crime of her ancestors, the Cetra may help us to let go our ancient grudge. Way to make her feel it? guilty for that. It is said the orb lies within a place of Cetra worship. A place of Cetra worship or temple. Yeah. You know what? 
have an idea. At least, I think but I do. why? Forgive me, Hollow One, if I Hollow regard one. you with suspicion. Now hold on there. I'm friend to one and all, thanks to my crystal ball. No matter your need, I have the right read. <laughs> <laughs> Hollow One, that's so... he can even tell He's that... He's strange, but you can trust him. Really. It appears we have been discovered. Discovered? I trust you will return our materia to its rightful home. By... okay. Only you can end our torment. Ah. Why did he have to take us all the way down here to tell us that? Couldn't he have told us that to begin with? I guess he wanted us to see the village and what had happened. <gasps> We're back here? The cave of the Gi? I guess he wanted us to see the village I and everything. Guess we're back. What? Yeah. <laughs> Just like... <laughs> what? It's closed off now. Like it never existed. We need to get moving. Right. Huh. Okay, there is more to that. Oh. Lana Key. I'll make you proud, Dad. Just wait. <laughs> shivers shivers <laughs> so wow okay um looking up i'm gonna run and take a you know a decongestion break real quick but um yeah so the cave of the gi i don't know what to make of all of that and it's interesting like even barrett going and picking up kate and then placing him behind them and stuff but kate has an idea so i figure we follow it um, there's a little bit more to that story, obviously, than, than what meets the eye. I think, you know, he's going to say what we want to hear to have our help. But I'm a little apprehensive about the whole idea of giving them materia, which we've known to be like a weapon, in order to release them from their, you know, their suffering, but I think that we need to discover more before I'm willing to just like blindly hand it over. Um, but that's an interesting kind of side part to all of this too. I, I don't know. There, there's definitely more there than meets the eye. I don't have a whole lot to say on it other than I, it makes sense why he had us go through there. I think, like I said that in a moment of like, oh man, you could have just told us the sooner, but I think he really wanted us to go and see where they came, what happened to them, um, their opinion on the cetera. It does draw a larger question or like it makes me think of more questions which kind of come down to you know the ancients we look at them as i think this kind of like awe and wonder because of their borderline extinction right they're on the brink of extinction um and their association with the planet but we don't know at what cost they're willing to protect the planet and what atrocities that could like make them turn to but the concept of the gi is a little confusing too because they are not born from the life stream i think i just need to go back and figure out exactly how they were created because they're not born from the life stream so they can't return to the life stream but they want an ending to their living or their shell of a life i suppose it's definitely interesting okay we'll come back i don't know what we're gonna do next i'm gonna play it by ear but i will be right back and we'll find out Okay. I wonder, okay, do I have to go out ma manually? Okay. It's good to see you again. The assistant. Allow me to escort you to fellow Bugenhagen. Please, this way. Okay. A helping hand. <laughs> Hook, line, and sinker. Those undead suckers actually oh. think we're gonna give them back their materia. They called it their salvation or whatever. But to me, it sounded more like something with the potential to wreak some serious That's why I was I was thinking no, it's more like no way in harm. Hell are we letting them have it. But Can't we'll let see. Him have it either. Him? Sephiroth wants it. Sephiroth. Did no one else sense him? Uh, no. You're the resident expert. If you say Sephiroth was there, I'll believe you. Wait, wait, wait. So, are you saying Sephiroth's after the Black Materia, too? Mm-hmm. Better to assume he is. Well, come on! Let's or... Go, let's go! 
he would want us to think that. So, Kitsu, I gotta ask, how do you know about the Setra Temple anyway? Uh, well, I... Uh, I'm trying to see them. I wouldn't say I know about it exactly. Not directly, anyway. What's that supposed to mean? I just recall some document or other discussing its existence. If Does he really know that much terminal, about Shinra? should be able to find it again. Terminal, huh? Mm. Is there any up here? I think so. But I bet old Boogie will know for sure. Boogie will know. <laughs> yeah, what if Sephiroth wants us to find it for him? I mean, why do the work yourself when you can have Cloud do it for you? The path of return. Why old Boogie? Thank you for the escort. I appreciate it. <laughs> Thank heavens you're alive. I feared you might have returned to the planet. Oh, come on. We both <laughs> know you didn't need to worry about me. After all, I am the son of Seto the Watcher. See that instant confidence? Me. But if I recall correctly, Shinra should have set up a transmission terminal here in Cosmo Canyon. So, where is it? Oh. oh what did become of that thing? He remembers it probably ages ah, ago. Yes. A now long I time. I was so fascinated by the technology it employed, uh, I did some tinkering. Some tinkering, I say. Though it was quite a lot. But oh. now it serves a decidedly more... Oh. You've got to be kidding me! <laughs> oh, well, he transformed into a wind tunnel. a Setra temple? A temple, you say? If you mean a place where they worshipped gods, none exist. Mm. The Setra never engaged in such practices. I didn't know that. Maybe it was referred to as such by someone ignorant of their culture. If instead it is a sign of importance to the Setra that you seek, texts do speak of one, and of the pains taken to conceal it. So, it does exist? Our next location. Oh, 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 oh. Perhaps, though I know not where it is. Uh-huh. And even should you find it, I would urge caution. They were a star-crossed people. To follow in their footsteps is to court tragedy. Hmm, I like the way they put However, that. The rewards may yet outweigh the risks. You must bring every one of your senses to bear. For I like how we don't no see his hand. Will elude you, however well hidden. And when you return home, I hope you'll share your discoveries with me. Fellow Bogenhagen. What is it? I'm a little busy here. They're under Another attack. Man in a black robe has come. What should oh. we do? Well now. A friend of yours? He Where'd knows. You see him? Oh, uh, the village gate. We should check it out. Yeah. yeah. Interesting. Maybe this will help us know exactly where to go. Speak to one of the... Oh, okay. So speak to one of the post guides or the guides and they will escort you to various locations around the settlement. A privileged service offered to the guests of fellow Bukenhagen. Very nice. <laughs> the workings of our so planet cute. are most fascinating, no? <laughs> okay, so let's Blessings ask him. The planet be upon you. Are you in need of guidance? Yes, to the front, the entrance. This is really nice. Yeah, I mean, the settlement's huge, so that makes sense having like a fast travel kind of kind of situation. Here we go. Oh, no. Nanaki. Is this the first one? Or he did say another. Is he said another. Okay? Yeah. He is, albeit rather weak. Not sure why, though. I know Mako poisoning when I see it. Right, it's not normal it. Mako poisoning. Nibelheim. 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 Are we gonna go back Nibelheim. there? Ain't that... Yeah. Artifa and I grew up. Oh, of course. Nibelheim has a terminal. I bet my fuskers We're going it. back home and seeing it, what uh, the aftermath was. Had a terminal. Cloud, remember what you told Gein attack back there? That I might be weird, but you can trust me. Hey, well, even if you were lying, I'm going to prove to you that you can trust me, that I'm on your side. It's not that. Hmm. He doesn't know I burned down. Hmm? 
We should go. <laughs> Wait, you're talking about heading to Nibelheim from here? Super far. There's no roads you can take far as I know. Maybe we can't go by land. But by air. Okay. But by air. Meaning we'll need smoke. <laughs> right then. Back to the Back airstrip. To the airstrip we go. Easy enough. New quests are available in Cosmo Canyon. We do have some Cloud. things to do, y'all. Proto relic energy signature confirmed. Oh no. And relatively close to you. While the signal is on the weaker side, it may serve as a good place to start. I'll send you the coordinates right away. We all know what that means. Time to explore Cosmo Canyon. Also phenomenon sites too. Ooh, this is exciting. Yeah, we haven't gone down here at all. Oh. It's going back to Nibelheim. To I can look after him. This is wild. Did you see that rope? Okay. Um I have to figure out how we'll even get down there. I guess we go over here and yeah, I guess we need to go grab our chocobo. There she is. Quee! Oh, can I do it more because I'm sick? Quee! <laughs> okay, we should be able to launch ourselves off. Ready? First gliding! Ah, this is nice. Ah, oh, look at this. Where do we want to go? So many different things. Let's go this way. We'll go turn on that one right there. The mobile. Wait, does that actually? Whoa, we're dropping, we're dropping. Dropping speed, glide in, glide in. Oh, cool. Let's check it out. I think we'll get there faster on foot anyway than gliding. Yeah, this is epic. Look at all the stuff over here, too. Okay, so we want to make sure that we explore all of the areas. Leave no gray area unturned. What is this? Oh, is that a sight? Hold on, let me try to... Wait, something is guarding that area, too. I don't think we can get there. We'll see. We'll turn on this thing and then see if we can do anything there. Okay, this is like the perfect congested, still kind of sick day activity. Just explore the region. I told you guys it's always so comforting to just kind of kick back, relax. Get some stuff done. Oh, crap. Did I need to get up here? Am I going to be able to traverse this? Whee! Whee! Let me see. Maybe go up this way. I'm getting more. Like, the longer that I'm recording for, the more my nose is, like, absolutely just losing it. All right, penguin. Oh, wow. I really do want Red back on the team. I feel like I got used to Red and I realize now that he's actually broken. Right? Focus shot on that. Get that penguin! Mess up that penguin! Perfect. Focus thrust. Stagger. Kill. Okay. Those are new kind of trees. I don't think we've seen those before. <coughs> Trying to get my voice back. Ugh. This will be like a good activity to kind of calm because I don't have to do as much talking when we're exploring the region too. Oh, oh, there it is, there it is. What was that? The wild blue yonder? Is that a different side mission? We must need to do something in those facilities, maybe, like where all these wind terminals are? Oh no, maybe not. Ah. Dried Oasis Tower. I didn't even realize that we had collected some of the stuff here. I guess finding the chocobo maybe counted as intel? Okay, I see we've got a fiend until there. That direction? Oh, come on. Okay, I was gonna say. Oh, one of those sand guys. You know what? I think the fiends are behind all of that. Okay, it's pretty catchy. 
I gotta say, it's kind of catchy. Da, 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 da. Through the tunnel? No, this is a different kind of pass, but we do need to go here anyway. We'll get to where we need to go eventually. I should have picked up some more side missions on the board before we started going all over the place. Okay, what are these guys? Ah, uh, ice. Okay. Do I have that? Why don't you lead the way? Mm. Go on. Get out of here. Ow. I got this. Hey, TB boost. Nice. All right, let's do a freeze. Blizzard level two. Don't overdo it. I'll take care of him. And then we want to drain him of his soul. Summon. Soul drain. Ow. He went immune to that? Braver. Triple slash. Oi. Don't touch the lady. Yeah, let's keep going. Look at the deer. What is that? A bow? What? More? Wait, what? Can we take a... Hi, guys. No, I don't think our mission's taken us here yet. So I don't think we're going to be able to do anything, but holy cow, wait, is it for a boat? No, it's not here right now, but this is some kind of nautical Cosmo Canyon port. What is the port here for? Pilgrimage to Cosmo. Huh. I guess you can't use it anymore, though. Hmm. A bit sad. Well, let me get this one. Maybe we'll cross paths with it again, though. Maybe. Okay, so we need to go this way. I think we have to be outside of this port. Yeah, let's go back to... Let's fast travel back here. Dang it. Yeah, because I don't think you can get to where I need to go. I need to be on the upper side. So I might have to glide to get there. It's possible. We can go to this one, too. Just keep traversing the area. See, what is this? What is this? I guess you can just see it, but you can't do anything. Figures, we don't want to mess with it. Next platform. Okay, have we seen that before? Keep or is that a new ho that hawk creature? No, we've seen it. It's your turn. Need my help, do you? Okay, let's go. Oh, it's coming after me. Oh gosh. Uh blizzard, level two. On the griffin! Wait, are you sure? See, no, I haven't scanned the griffin. Yeah. I didn't think I had. All right, blizzard on these guys. Ow. Maybe it was still susceptible to that, though. But arrow would probably do the best against it. Poor guy standing in the way of the griffin, so he's getting absolutely obliterated. I got this. Ugh, these guys. Their hard shell makes it really difficult. Griffin's defeated. Let's go here. Go Blizzard level two. Deal with that. Here goes. Chill. Get him. Get him. Nice. Perfect. All right, we gotta freeze this guy. And go spell Blizzard level two. My turn. Oh. Hit him. Pressure him. Beautiful. Uh, these ones are going to be difficult to do, though. Yuffie level 42. Uh, doing the the fighting ones in this area. I think the enemy intel is going to be aggravating. I know they're going to give me like a challenge that's going to take me a couple tries. Nothing's ever easy. Oh my goodness. They are making us travel this. <gasps> Wait, Moogle! We gotta find the Moogle Tower! <gasps> oh, this is gonna be so hard to do, too. The next Moogle section. <laughs> oh, look at the wall climbing over there. Let's go over there next. I bet you that's a life spring. And we need to do summons. We have so many things we need to catch up on, guys. I say I'm doing everything whenever I find it. Not true. I'm oh, there's the Moogle Hut! <gasps> Perfect! <laughs> Dun, 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 dun. Moogle Hut, so let me go to the map. I can hear, I just can tell. I'm so 
just what? Hold on, wait, 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 wait. No, that's the tower. There's another tower so close to it? Isn't that kind of weird? Maybe not. Okay. <coughs> I definitely want to go to that Moogle Tower, but I... That, that's what I wanted to look at. What is that? You're on a choco If I wasn't sick. Okay, let's hop off. Old Worm Cavern? Is that what it said? Oh, it's a, it's a cache location. There's probably just a treasure at the top. Yeah. Man, I was really expecting more. But I'll take it. All right, can you glide off? No. Can I just jump? Ugh. Just let me just jump. You should just be able to go. Is that a life spring? Look at all that stuff. That's gotta be a life spring. That's a lot for a single area, right? Maybe not if there's something actually- Oh! Oh, I see one! I see one! How do we get on that side? We need to somehow glide? But I couldn't use the chocobo to glide there. Oh, but you could use- Okay, so wait, wait, hold on. Maybe if I go this way. Can we get my chocobo? Or... Wait a minute. What is this? This is weird. I can't glide in there, but I can't... Wait, can I crouch under right there? I bet you I can crouch under right there. No. No. Huh. Wait, 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 bunnies, bunnies, bunnies. Hold on. Bunnies. Where? Oh, there. Hmm. Nice. Okay, Phoenix Plume's done. Hey, little guys. Maybe we need to somehow get up in that air system? There's another one right there. Treasure number two. We need to get inside of that. Maybe if we climbed up, we could somehow glide into it? The Chocobo can't climb it. See, I think we have to use that to give us a wind boost and kick us inside of it, maybe. I don't know. I'll try. Whenever I can find a way to. More ruins, but not related to bunnies. Whoa! Is that the first time we've seen a ram? Also Chocobo stop, but I don't think we've seen a ram before. Did y'all see them? Look, there's more! Hi, puppy. Take me to your Chocobo stop. Well, this one's all hidden out here in the back. <laughs> Another golden plume. And there is an intel, there's a fiend intel near us right now. Okay, we'll grab this. Ah! Yeah, I think the only difficult part about navigating this location is just the ups and downs. Having to use the wind probably to get around a little bit. But all sorts of new items, transmuting things. Oh, see, that is maybe a platform that will let us bunnies. So a lot of rabbits. A lot of treasures to dig up. Oh. 
Come on. That must be it. I'm gonna go around them. Hmm. But it's still just sage and oregano, which we don't need for whoa. Oh, they're mandrakes. Yeah, pressure stagger defeat. Rare pressure stagger defeat. Cap and wire. Mandrakes. Oh my that goodness. Both visual and auditory senses. The copper wire tracks prey through vibrations in the ground, unleashing a relentless stream of precise oh, attacks with its whip-like lines. Okay, at least these because are just normal. Pressure stagger. Supple and sturdy. Humans have used them as a material for handicrafts throughout history. The hmm. lines of this particular variant are resistant to fire. A house wrapped in them could burn to the ground, and the tendrils would remain. It's actually There's pretty no cool. telling what untapped potential these plant fiends possess. We are counting on you to help us find out. House material. What's your house made of? Oh, just cappy wire. Just casual cappy wire. What am I doing? What was I gonna do there? Just casual yes. cappy wire. All right, first strike in. So we need to scan them first and foremost. Probably freeze if I had to guess. I'm gonna take a wild guess and say freeze and not even waste my time. I'll show you what I can do. No, actually. Hold on. Assess. Okay, that's not freeze. No, it is freeze. A rare cappy wire variant that mutated after surviving a forest fire. Okay, wait, 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 wait. It will start countering attacking after you see it spark. Exploit its elemental weakness will pressure it. So we need to see it spark. Oh my gosh, guys, I have a minute left and I'm getting tossed. Just spark. Okay. I guess this one. Calling ice. It's on now. Okay, there's it. Pressured. Staggered. Okay, now we just need to kill him. Kill them all. That was not the right thing to use. Hold on. Abilities. Blizzard level two on this guy. I got this. Get him. Get him. I keep my distance. Stop doing Sorcerer Storm. Why do I always do that? Oh my gosh, they just keep firing. Let's do this. Keep Pesky little bugs. Ow. I mean, I got it, but that's just an annoying little bug. Yeah, enjoy that. Oh. That's weird to see it pop one of the later ones. Maybe that's to happen before. Did you see that? It's one of the middle combat assignments. That's so strange. Okay, so there's apparently something up here. But I don't think I can actually climb up this far. I don't think I can go up this. I'm gonna have to somehow glide there. Yeah, look at that. Oh, no, I don't want to fight you. I don't. I'm fleeing. I don't want to fight them. I don't want to do this. Stop. Thank you, guys. I need to find a chocobo stop, honestly. Let me heal Aerith. Okay. Let me get my chocobo back before I was so rudely interrupted. So I wonder if this thing will launch me up. Yes. Okay, so now we're able to glide. Oh, 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 wait, wait. Let me get back on it. Okay, glide. Hold on. So these will launch us up, right? So it'll give us a little burst. Ah, land, land. That's kind of difficult. That's not as easy as I was expecting. Oh, there it is. Yeah, so we're in the right area. This way. Gliding range number nine. Is this Chanel number nine? Oh yeah, this is a life spring, that's for sure. Another life spring. You go around this whole area? This will be how I get out of it, but I want to go out of the the glide terminal too. Oh my gosh, my voice is getting worse, guys. I might have to stop. 
<laughs> it's straining so much. <sighs> oh. 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 I'm gonna choke a bow. Your no, it's gonna be stuck on my head now. No. I'm gonna get a little bit more done. Oh, that should be. Oh, it's our second info, so we didn't get anything new. Cloud, by analyzing the LifeSpring data, I was able to locate an old Republic transmitter chip. Mm. First, look for a weathered old ship, then scour the surrounding area. A I trust you'll have ship. no trouble finding this distinctive landmark. Easy enough. Dilapidated ship. Oh, somewhere we haven't been. <gasps> okay, we should at least do the Moogle Hut. Here's my, here my, here's my thoughts. All right. I'm going to go back here. We're going to go explore the Chocobo Hut. Oh, wait. I think in order to explore the Chocobo Hut, I need to go out the gliding range. Yeah, let's do this. Ready? Whoosh. Glide, 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 glide. Nice. Don't descend, don't descend. Glide up. Get me to that Moogle hut. Okay, the Moogle hut should be near. Where do we need to go? Ah, oh, we need to get up higher. Hmm. I was like, okay, maybe I'm pushing it a little too much. So I probably will just go a little bit further and then take the break that my body clearly needs. But there's one more Moogle hut. This way? Go! Glide! It's not Pico anymore. I have to remember it's not my friend Pico. There's a uh, material or something to pick up right there. There's something blue. Oh, it's a bird. Oh, it's a bird. Oh, it's a... Um, oh, oh. Of course. It's um a life spring. Another life spring. But I haven't been here before. Wait a minute. It's this way. Okay, I'm not even closer to the Moogle. Uh, actually, kind of. Nice. This is our next piece of information on this area, too. This is gorgeous. I never tire of the looks of the life springs. I'm gonna just go pull. Yeah. Mm. Okay, this should give us information about maybe the life or how it happened, maybe how it came to be. No, we saw how it came to be. Blue Bluster Cave Life Spring. <laughs> life in Cosmo Canyon. That's right. Okay, let's see. Life. I normally wouldn't read this, I probably shouldn't, but the founders of the canyon's eponymous, eponymous village made use of the naturally formed caves, and following the emergence of plantology, more and more people found themselves drawn to the place. The makeshift walkways and tent-like domiciles, domiciles have only increased in number as the settlement continues to expand to this day. Rather than rely on Mako, the villagers built an array of windmills, and each home is equipped to store the generated electricity. This is too much for me. A leading plantologist, Bugenhagen, um, introduced this form of wind power to Cosmo Canyon, and it is said his technical marvel was inspired by the ways of the Cetra. When it comes to nutrition, the villagers' diet consists mainly of grain and legumes, that makes sense, grown around the village and supplemented by game meat obtained by traditional hunting methods. Huh. They really did give us a good look at their life. Okay, I'm gonna do like one more thing and then I'm gonna break. I know, I could just hear you guys being like, stop pushing yourself. I know. It's hard because when you start to feel the energy back when you're sick, you, you wanna like throw yourself back into it, but you have to remind yourself that if you do, you're gonna get more sick or you're gonna prolong it. So I'm gonna be smart here and end in a second. Huh. I don't see the rabbits. It must be this way. No. It's another one of these paths. 
But I don't think I can actually get in them. I don't know, I never tried. Yeah, the way is shut. It was made by those who are dead. There's a stop up here. <gasps> I need to rest here. I actually, I need to pop a cushion. So cute. Okay, let me pop off real quick. Okay, pet him. Pets. Scritchy scratches. Oh my gosh, do you guys remember scritchy scratches from FF16? The scritchy scratches. <laughs> okay. <coughs> We're gonna rest. And I'm gonna break because I'm trying to be kind to myself and not push myself too far. So even though I want to get that Moogle head, I'm going to wait. I'm going to wait till tomorrow. It'll be the same video for you guys, but for me, I'm going to pop out of here and go get some rest for the rest of the day. But we actually made pretty good progress in today's video, and I'm slowly starting to get back to my, you know, normal output, I should say. But all right, so we're actually about one third of the way done with Cosmo Canyon. And so we'll pick back up. Well, I'll see you in a sec. I'll see you in a second. It's a different day for me, but I'll see you in a second. I'll be back. And I'm back, guys. Let's get back into it. Hopefully, I'm. it's the start of a new day. I'm still a little congested, as you can tell by my voice, but I feel a lot better. So I think we can clear Cosmo Canyon. On to the Moogle Hut. I think this way will take us there. Yes. I was so close. Y'all know I wanted to do that before I headed out yesterday. Ah! It's okay. Good things come to those who wait. Oh, this one's gonna be so much harder than before. Wow, look. We haven't been to any of those structures. Hold on, let me look at the map. Oh, yes, that's all new territory and the proto relic. Plantological ruins. Hmm. Oh yeah, we do need to finish the side quest and Chadley. I will do summons in this episode. Mark my words, I'll do at least one summon. I know it's like killing you guys that I haven't done them yet, but I, I don't need them that much. I can only use three summons at a go anyway. Would you mind rounding up all the mooglets for me? I know, it's part of the side quest of. Oh, no. All right, Malulu, coming for you. Oh my gosh. Malulu, get over here. Oh, wait. Hold on. She's gonna. Ah! Ah! Malulu, get your. Malulu! Get in there. Nice. One. Nice. Malulu done. Moki. Moki? Mosh. Let's do Mosh. Mosh and their little flying saucers. <laughs> Don't dance after that. Don't look so proud. You. Moki, get in there. I gotta roll. Woo! Okay, let's start a tornado. Easiest thing. All right. Moog and get in that tornado. Get in that tornado. Get in. Moog. Moog. Get in that tornado. No. Get him. Got him. This is only gonna take me part of the distance. Run. I have to make up for last time. It was embarrassing. Moog straight up embarrassed me. Oh, well thank you, Moog. All right, Malala, get over her. Get, oh, 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 shoot. All right, Malala. Oh my gosh, Malala, you crazy bean. Okay, let me start this. Get in that tornado. Get in there. Ow! Oi! If I get hit one more time, I'm gonna lose. Oh no. Oh no. Go in there. Go in there. Yes. Oh. <laughs> that was almost as bad as, oh my gosh. If I had to do that again, I would have been fuming. That last time I had to make up for the last moogs. This Mugs. Is open. 
and it's all thanks to you. Oh, we should There's have some level ups too. To We've come so far, Koopo. I hope that you'll see it through. There's only one. So we're gonna only explore one more area then. I'd assume that there'd only be one more region to explore. Anything interesting. Catch your eye, Koopa. Dang. I'm not ready for this game to be over. Not that we're getting close. I just... She just said that there's only one left. Empowerment earrings. I have so many. I might as well just pick up everything. I don't know what I can do for this. But maybe this level is used for... Oh, shoot. I don't need that many. Hold on. Maybe it's used for... If there's only one left, we might as well use... I wonder if we can craft something cool with it. Okay, I'm gonna leave it at that. Thank you. you, find anything you like? Okay, let me go to... Kate. Oh, shoot. I gotta use Kate and Barrett. We gotta finish Barrett's. But I need to use Kate. Okay, let's go over one and let's switch. Actually... We're just going to switch Aerith out for... Oops. You know, it's like another day, but you somehow feel worse. And I know y'all are going to be like, it's because you're pushing yourself. I'm not pushing myself. <laughs> I'm fine. I'm fine. I just think you have good days. And then like sometimes, plus the allergy season here has been insane. My uh, black truck is green. Hello? Sounds about right. Okay. This is a gliding. Let's go to the gliding number. Or wait, there's a gliding pad down here too. Do we want to go back over? Oh, snaps. Snappy. No, I just need to head over here the, to the excavation site. Okay, let's call her Chocobo. Yeah, I just would assume if she's saying there's only one left. Then there's only one area that we're going to explore after this. I know it's been a long, like, it's been a lot. Like, we've done a lot in this amount of time. But it somehow still feels like it's never enough. Okay, let's go over to that site if we can make it. Glide on, glide on. That should be all new, too. Perfect. Yes. Where's my landing zone? Actually, I think we can land right on it. I don't know, we're coming in hot. No! I'm gonna clip it. Oh. Perfect. Good work. Oh no, I gotta get off you. Hold on. Beautiful. I guess you could have landed over there. Oh, do you see what I see? There's a part for another summon. <clears throat> Also, what is that clicking noise? It sounds like a timer going off. Okay, this is Revna weight number four out of six. Yep, I see it. Gorgeous. Look, I think I see a life spring too. Look at all of the vegetation over there. It's gotta be a life stream. That's got to show a lot of things. Yep, yeah, two, three. Okay. But that is a live stream. Did you see that? Perfect. Almost halfway there. We'll probably take a break about the halfway point and we'll go uh, do some Chadley stuff. Ding, ding, ding. Okay. Ride this down. Good morning, y'all. Okay, I think it's gonna be this way. So we actually need to get our chocobo. Actually, we might be fighting things. I don't know. That's fine. Our trusty steed. <gasps> rabbits, rabbits, where? Where? I see them, I see them. Everybody watch out. It's right there. Do. I go this way. I don't know what it is about this texture and this area, but I have a burning desire to replay Jedi Survivor. I don't know. <laughs> I think it's because of the... Ah, uh, I'm going to fall. Bahamut! It's Bahamut! 
Oh my gosh, I was wondering if we were gonna see Garuda or Bahamut. Oh my gosh, guys. Oh. Dion. Sad. All right, square, triangle, square, triangle, square, circles. All right, I'm gonna have to track that again. Square, triangle, square, triangle, square, circle, square, circle. So basically squares in between everything, two triangles, two circles, starting at almost three o'clock, ending after nine. Start with squares, two triangles, two circles. Okay. Let's see if I can do this. Square, triangle, square, triangle, square, circle, square, circle. Do you remember how long it took me to be able to say Bahamut in the in uh, FF16? That was embarrassing. Maybe we'll fight uh, Bahamut because he is one of my, well, he was tethered Analysis to one of my complete. favorite characters. I managed to extract the necessary data from the crystal. This should allow me to strengthen your materia. I absolutely am gonna run Bahamut if we can do it. I probably am still saying it wrong. Now that I think about it, I'm probably acting so proud of myself when I'm still saying it drastically wrong. In that case, we won't... Yuffie, in that case, we won't go... Oh, 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 what's that? Oh, this is another path. Oh, maybe this is the way to the life spring. Ooh, back roads. Country roads, take me home. You can go this way to get here. Oh, wait, 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 boxes, boxes. Watch out. Oi, get out of the way. Hmm. This is actually perfect because we won't really do too much main mission stuff. Just because I feel like, um, I don't know, it'll be nice to be able to hopefully be better by the time we break into more main mission. So I'm not sounding like a, I don't know. Oh, I <laughs> just, I'm so, my whole voice changes whenever I'm sick. And like, sometimes it goes raspy, sometimes it goes nasally. This is the nasally one. The raspy one's not so bad. Both of the treasures are right here. Blue Hawk. Mm. Quay. All right, give me one second. I'm kicking boxes over here. There's so many goodies in this area. Okay, that's where we came from. Cactus over there. Ah, wait this direction. There might be a little chick here too, a posh chocobo. Yep, what did I say? It looked just like, oh, this is beautiful. What is that? Wait a minute, have we seen those ruins before? It's like a whole, okay, maybe we'll try to go over there next. I wonder what the side missions in this region will be. Hmm. This is it, oh. I knew it said it, but I didn't... This is like such a interesting location for it to be. Duh. I love it. Plateau ruins life spring. I need to see if you have to... I think you have to beat it on hard mode to get... Huh. Upon analyzing the data from the life oh, spring, I was able to locate a new transmuter chip. It's buried in some nearby mountain ruins. <gasps> the ones across the way? A survey of these ruins is in progress. Yes, it's gotta be. But they were built by the ancients, or others like them. Okay, that Perhaps could be early. you an investigation of your own while looking for the transmuter chip. You got it, Chadley. I saw a lot of you guys don't actually like Chadley. My boy Chad Michael Murray. <coughs> Astonishing. Actually, it's in our same spot. I don't find it that shocking because I guess if you're not like a big side mission person, or even if you are, it's a lot of him being like, do this, do that. It's a lot of it's a lot of missions for him. It's a lot of he asks a lot of us. Okay. Hmm. Oh, upstairs. You guys were close, but you had to go upstairs. 
uh, right there. I'm so excited to go to Niflheim. Nope, not Niflheim. Nibelheim. Thank you. <laughs> Wrong game. Hold on. Nibelheim. I have a burning feeling that something's in this area. Hold on. No, this is on the... Okay, this is out, but hold on. But I still feel like there's something over here. Mm, it's on the other side. Get it, get it. Okay, it's down this way. Oh, okay, hold on. Oh, wow. My bird's nose is pretty good. I might not be able to smell anything right now, but my bird can. Probably in this area since these two are here. Maybe down there. Yeah. On the other side, which tells me upstairs. Yeah, look. The arrow is pointing up. Yeah, we gotta go up. Another upstairs spot. I'm sorry. Da -da -da. Let me get this stuff. I think it's up on the third floor. But let's just double check. Yeah. Third floor bound. Ah! The tippy top. What is that? Enhanced road. Let's check this out. Oh, wait. Let him talk first. Hold on. I love getting these because look, the snail shell bracelet. Now you can craft it. A lot of times, yeah, you get the ability to craft the items from the region, but I also might break it with a side mission too. Let me see. Hi, Ether. I can make it now. I want to make the Giga Potion, but I still haven't gotten any of the- Whoa! Hold on. Enhanced Outlaw Bracer. Although I'm not using it on anybody, so I don't know if it's worth. <coughs> it might not be worth- Oh, now this would be. No, no, that's the advanced road. <sighs> Wait a minute. Enhanced Snail. The Enhanced Snail. Draconic Ring. Dude, that looks sick. Dude. Oh, I forgot that I can craft a lot of this stuff. Grants immunity to instant death, stone, and petrify. Again, situational, but amazing. Especially if you know the challenge going into it. Hi, Ether. Mm. I'll go ahead and craft it. Gorgeous. We'll do Planet's Mercy. Planet's Mercy should grant us something else. This is Planet Spirit, damn it. <gasps> but I can do the Commanders and the Spirit Bound, which are no longer what I really need, but um, it helps so that I can, yeah. Planet Spirit is the next big thing that I need. I'm gonna go ahead and craft the Enhanced. We're so close to 14. Exquisite Beast Hide. Wait, I need a, do I not have a Road Warrior Bangle to begin with? Pretty sure I do. 14. Holy cow, my voice is wavering. Oh, wait, 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 go back. <laughs> Why do I talk like you? Like, I'm, I talk like I'm not the one driving. I don't know. <laughs> And I wonder why so many people are like, oh, I didn't actually realize it was pre-recorded. <laughs> Nobody's watching me. Like literally it's just me sitting by myself. Again, I could talk to a paint or a wall, but all right, let's do this proto relic since we're right here anyway. I could literally talk to a wall and be happy. It's simultaneously sad and impressive. Oi, pick it up. Bubby, there you go. Planet's Mercy. That's a fiend intel. That's not a fiend intel. It's a golem. Ow. Kitty wallop. I was like, all of a sudden I feel very, um... Hold on. I need to do the smackdown so I can finish that. That should be a weapon mastery. Okay, so we need to do Let's Ride. Now we need to cast Moogle Magic. What does this do? Oh! 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 
It's okay, get it. Get back up, get back up. Ooh, I like this, kinda. Oh! Wait a minute, I like this. Hold on. Wait, wait, I can't cast it anymore. I like this distance. Like, I like him throwing from on top of the Moogle. I think I'm actually doing no. Oh, he's coming over here! Moogle, take it for me! Moogle magic. Use equipped summons ability. Can only use while riding Moogles during battles to summon it. Okay, wait, wait, wait. Let's try that. Use summon... Oh, wait. Summons abilities. Wait, did I just, like, pummel? I'm trying to figure this... Oh, yeah, look! Titan! Titan literally... Whoa! That's so cool. Okay, so Titan came out because I had Titan assigned to me. Okay, I understand it now. I understand it, and I love it. Kitty actually could wreck somebody. Hold on. Let's go Mega Potion. I love that. That's amazing. Yeah. That ain't bad. Bunnies, bunnies, bunnies. Choco? Baby, baby. You're on a chocobo. There's no way I can sing right now with that, but I'm there in spirit. Another by exquisite beast. There's another golem. But why is it showing feed? Oh, because it is a fiend intel. Oh. Dangerous fiends may be in the vicinity. Exercise caution. Why is it showing? A variant detected. Commencing guidance protocol. Stray, what's up there? I will say this is an extremely enjoyable area to kind of navigate and just check off. I really do feel like now that I'm looking back, sorry, I know this is so random. I'm just like, oh, like I knew she was in the middle of talking. I really disliked Coral Region the most. I think that's where it just kind of took the wind out of my sails a bit. Golems are not living creatures. <coughs> They're soulless clay dolls, animated only by the life Oh. Stream. It is thought that the ancients created them long ago with their unique technology. Though it remains unclear why they would have left their constructs Tower. in a place like this. We may for the sake of the locals, if nothing else. For the sake of the locals. I know you! Kitty Wall, get it, get it, get it. Now that I know Kate Sith is like a distance, like it's ranged, I think I'll start using Kate more. Okay, let's ride. Ah! Get him, Moogle, get him! Oh, but now I'm not. Okay, that's interesting. Let me assess him real quick. Okay, that's Okay, so wind. They lose energy every time they attack or take damage. They become pressured once their energy is exhausted. Hang back. Okay, let's do... I don't have that. But I can just hit him with a fire. I don't have that either. That's a bit unfortunate. Does he have wind? Uh, he has wind. Okay. I don't know how we're gonna pressure that though. Mm. I'm not gonna pressure him or stagger him, guys. Oh, never mind. Uh, belay that. <laughs> Okay, he's starting to build up pressure. Nice, nice. You got Let's get that focus thrust. Nice. Okay. Ignore me. Triple slash that. ATB boost. Braver. Let's go. Moogle magic. Get away! What am I doing? Oh, I'm summoning, I'm summoning, I'm summoning! What is that? 
Titan's getting back in there. I forgot that I have Titan on Kitty. Forgotten toys. Not, not, what? No, I haven't completed all Intel. Oh, with this one, okay. I thought they meant for the region. I was just throwing me off for a second. I knew you'd come through, Cloud. After processing the intel you gathered and importing it into our simulator, I designed a combat trial just for you. Of While course you did. you provided assistance, my, <laughs> I am the one who created it. At any rate, please give it a try. Naturally, you know that I'm going to ignore you for a little bit longer, Chadley. I know you're saying give it a try, but... When have I ever? So we need to get up here. I don't know. Oh, I wonder what this proto relic situation is gonna be. We've had. Oh no, there's another golem right there. Let me go off road. I need to go off road. Hmm. It's like buried up inside. Okay, ignore the golem. Nope, no, no. This is the life spring. It's up here. And you know what? I'm gonna need to take flight. I think we're gonna need to take flight. Let me try to do this. Let me see. Oh! Bunnies? Hold on. We've got a path over here. If anything, I might as well just go ahead and clean up the... Um, oh, hey buddies! What are y'all doing up here? Is that one I haven't done yet? Oh, there's another air platform. Yeah, I think the concept of this whole area is amazing with the like wind tunnels kind of launching you up and stuff. I like it. Yeah, this whole area is unexplored. But I gotta figure out how to get there. I have a feeling you can't get to it from here. Yeah, see, it's almost like... It's not a platform. Um... Where's the other Remna wave? There. Okay, we just go across. Launch me. A nice casual glide. Uh, see, I'm not, I'm changing my controller and nothing's happening, like to rotate it. But maybe I'm doing it that, doing it wrong. There's a whole, okay, hold on. Maybe I should have gone by flight to get over there. I don't think I can just jump down. Mm, bunnies, bunnies. Not bunnies, penguins, evil penguins. There we go. Yeah, okay, I hear him. But first, ancient baths. Oh my gosh. Should be one more. Oh, we jumped right on a life spring. This should be new intel, too. New reading. Actually, the final reading for this area. But before we do that life spring, bear with me. Oh, there's little bits of water, too. I want to find that last, um... Yeah, we're still in here. There it is. Hmm. Ding. Quick. Oh, I definitely can't do it when I'm sick. Although you'd think I could, because of the, like, wee. Okay. I might have to pop and decongest in a second here. <laughs> I'll be right back. <laughs> Let me finish this life spring first. Gorgeous. Temple Way life spring done. Up Officially 50% of the way done. The Cetra and the Ghee. Okay, here's, this is gonna be important. This is good, this is good. The Cetra and the Ghee. In the distant past, the Cetra made contact with the Ghee, entities who could not return to the life stream. Pitying their plight, the Cetra built altars to commune with and calm those tormented souls in the hope of finding a means to coexist peaceably. Interesting, okay, so they were the ones to create that. 
Over time, the Cetra grew increasingly aware of the dire fate that would befall the planet, and resolved to entrust their knowledge to the people of Cosmo Canyon. These teachings would become the foundation of plantology, which continues to be refined through research and discourse, even as it is spread throughout the world. When the Cetra finally departed Cosmo Canyon, none remained to provide solace to the Gi, who in their festering anguish and rage were driven to turn on the villagers. Many brave warriors gave their lives to beat back these vengeful spirits, entombing them in a prison once more. When the Cetra finally departed it, none, yeah, yeah, that's true, to solace, yeah, the Gi. So they've just had so many years to just be angry, honestly. Um, okay, let me step aside for a second. I'll be right back. Ow! There's a chair in my way. I can't roll out like I normally do. <laughs> what in the world? All right, y'all. Let's head over to... I'm not going to get to that proto-relic, but let's just try to get to the... thingy thing. You know. Of course, that thing. Oh my goodness. But the question is, how do I get over there? <laughs> Am I gonna have to fast travel somewhere? Jump down, Pico. It's not even Pico. Ah, oh. how am I supposed to get out of this situation? Oh, I guess I can go through here. Okay, no, no, no. This is good. This is good. Oh, rabbits, 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 rabbits. Oh. Oh, no, those are pigeons. Rabbits. Excuse me, excuse me. Crafting, no ore. There's another one. Okay, we need to get down this whole thing. Is there anything else on this hill? Possibly, but we'll need to get the, need to get the intel scoop first. Oh. Okay, I'm going the complete opposite direction. Let me wind around here. Don't look at them. Don't talk to them. We're not fighting them. We're not friends. We're not hanging. Here we go. And there's also one of those nearby too. Crimson Earth Tower. Oh, great, these guys. Okay. Get him, kitty wild. Uh, freeze. <laughs> Let's ride. And I already finished this too. <laughs> Drop kick him. Get him. Hold on. Let's do Moogle magic on him. Hold on. All right, we've got Titan coming in here. Oh my gosh. It's effective. <coughs> oh. He's coming. Ah! All right, I'm fighting somebody else. Okay, let's go focus the rest. Feel that pressure. Kitty wallop. Kitty wallop him. Man, I'm getting my butt kicked by these guys. Let's do rolling dice. I'm gonna need to do a prey. Total outrage. Oh. He just got them to focus on him. That's awesome. Beautiful. I'm not fleeing. Level up for Kate. Kate's level 40 now. Beautiful. You know what? I should do a hard save real quick. I was just thinking about that. Wait. Are you kidding me? It was because I went too far. That's okay. Yeah, I'm so sure. That actually should affect two people, I think. Yeah, that should go to both of them. Nice. That is so strong. Okay, we're gonna do something with that. Yeah, did you see that? So that was Kate having... Kate has ice with magnify. I need magnify on everybody. That was actually amazing. And that is actually not even maxed magnify. Oh, wait, it's down here. Oh, I keep thinking that I'm getting better, but my congestion's worse than ever. 
Hmm. One more tower left? I guess we could beeline for the last tower, but I don't even know if I've seen it. This might show us where it is. No, it's probably down in... All the towers are already showing. Is that it? No, that one's been activated. That one's been activated. Up here? I don't even know if I can... Oh, you'd have to go through here. I could do that. I could do that. Okay, we might as well go to the Fiend Intel over here. And that was where the Divine Intel was. And I do want to get Bahamut, so... Yeah, we'll want to do that next. Is that the Fiend Intel? Up there somewhere. Do, 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 do. Oh, I'm assuming that you can land up here. Yeah, maybe you can actually get to this by flying. You can go up even farther. No, there's not a landing pad. It's actually just for boxes. It's for a Moogle medal. What I won't do for a Moogle medal, I guess. Don't go up, Kate. Don't go up. Don't go up. Everybody down. Everybody down. All right, we're really close to that divine. So let's actually go hit that up. That should be on the side of this um, kind of mountainous area. Yeah, there it is, I think. No, what is that glowing? Oh. It's in there. I think it's, no, it's not. Okay. Never mind. I thought it was, oh yeah, actually look at that. No, 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 I do have to, um, wait, maybe not. Wait, yes, but I can't get to that except for, if I flew, I was there already. It was underneath me. Oh my gosh, okay, wait, we can jump off right here. I think they have a gliding, oh, nope, nope, nope. I think they have a gliding path intentionally for that, because they know, yeah. Lighting range, yeah, because otherwise this is... Whee! Yep, here we go. Perfect. Yes! I kind of want to go grab the third piece of this, like try to find the third piece so we can try to take him down. He's probably going to be one of the hardest ones yet. I'd imagine they get harder the more that you collect. Okay, that's not hard. Okay. Oh, wait. Wait, wait, wait. Circle, triangle, XX. Circle, triangle, XX. Circle, triangle, XX. Circle, triangle, XX. Okay. Circle, triangle, XX. Circle, triangle. Oh, no. Hold on, dude. Hold on. He's gonna get mad. Retry. Circle, triangle, XX. Circle, triangle. Okay. Circle, triangle, XX. Circle, triangle, XX. Is there, there's not another one. I messed up. <laughs> I did too many. Circle, triangle, XX, circle, triangle, XX. Ooh. That one actually, as far as like knowing what to press seemed easier than the previous one, but. Hmm. We're closing in. Summon crystal, done. We can go get that enemy until we're missing a lot of work. posh chocobo stops. Data from other crystals as well. Yeah, there's a lot of posh chocobo stops that we're missing because look at this. There, there's no stops near here. That just seems weird. I'm going to do the chocobo from here. Okay, so now we want to head up to this fiend intel. And you know what? We can honestly, I think this will take us near there. The scenic spot too. Yeah. Go past them. Oh, okay. It's okay. It's okay. The basilisk. Wallop him. That's right. Let's do dodge and dive. Actually crush it. Oh, he went underground. 
Magnify, Magnify just improved too, by the way. So I do want to get Magnify on other characters. Maybe on Cloud at a minimum. Especially when he maxes Fire and Ice. Can you imagine? Actually, I should probably Easy fight these. The first time I go through, I really should fight everything organically. Okay, so we want to do Kitty Wallop. Ow. We want to do Blizzard. Yeah. Oh my gosh, that was beautiful. It's just so good. It's just too good. Nice. Nice. Yeah, I am absolutely gonna... Do I even have any other ones of that? Let me go up here. Hold on. Let me go to combat settings. I know I keep saying like, oh, I love that. Like, I'm gonna use that. But let me see. I have healing. Healing doesn't matter. Fire and ice. I'm still trying to get that MP up. Once we get that, I'll switch this to magnify. I only have one magnify. You know, magnify might actually be hard to come across. I don't have a summon on me right now because I gave it to uh, Kate. Yeah. Where am I? <laughs> okay, this is not where I meant to go at all. But I do need to go over here anyway, so we'll go to the scenic, scenic stop. Wait a minute. Um, something's off here. I, I think this is a dead end. Wait, no, maybe. No, no. Wait. What in the world? Oh, this is like a way that you can come down from, but I don't think you can go back up that way. I don't think so. Hmm. I might as well fast travel to this airstrip and do the wild blue yonder. Wait, that's main mission. The wild blue on. Oh, the wild blue yonder is the main mission. We don't want to go there. Ignore me. Um, we want to find all of that. So I'm trying to figure out where I should go to get to that. You know what? We should go do that dig. So let me actually fast travel here real quick. We want to get that dig done. And then we want to go up to that like northern area. So for me, if I want to get this, I need to head down that way. So I'm going to take this launch, but oh, what? Oh, okay. That was so weird. Okay, we'll glide like this. Here we go. This will work. I'm going in the right direction. Yeah, look, 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 look. That, that must be the rubble of the ship. Yeah, they did say it was a ship. Yeah, and I haven't explored this area at all. This is probably a cache location, too. And good materials. Oh, here we go. So there's definitely going to be one around here. Maybe. We've got a couple. Wait. Wait. Wait a minute. It's definitely from behind me. Ooh. Hopefully I can get this without triggering that penguin. Do it. Oh, come on. Okay. All right. Where do they say something else? Who wins? That would not. Oh, oh. Get him. Get him. Wallop him. Smack him. Staggered. Do Moogle? No, I'm doing roll. I do kind of like that. Arrow and Blizzard. Wait. He gets random. Okay, I have not actually, I guess, taken a deep dive into seeing exactly what all of his abilities do, which I probably should. That could be really good. You could definitely get some weaknesses there. Vial of Celerus. The Celery. The <laughs> Vial of Celery. Okay, zoom over here. There's definitely gonna be one up on the airstrip, so I might as well go, oh, hold on. It's, yeah, it's up there, absolutely. Get up top here. Should be somewhere around here. In the ship itself. Ah. Uh. This is cool though. Yeah, look, it's gonna be nice. 
How did a ship even get here? I guess it, did they say it used to be filled with water, the canyon. You can transmute an enhanced commander's... <gasps> can I actually do that right now? Because I did craft one, but I'm not... Oh, I don't have anybody wielding it. Spirit bound. I should be able to. Yes. Nice. I mean, it's only five, but still. Still nice. There's something I can craft in this, or it's trying to show me the Celerus. No, I can craft a remedy. Hmm. The remedy is for... Cures all detrimental status. Not bad. Yeah, a vial of Celerus. The remedy is pretty. Again, there's so much detail. And like, like, look at that. Maiden's Kiss. So much detail in every single item. I just, whoever created the concepts behind a lot of the art, incredible. Okay, so the final one. Mm. This way. Da, da, da. Done. You can now transmit a healing coconut? Coconut? What? She had flash. the dilapidated ship done and another piece of intel bites the dust let's go ahead and just clear this area up here i was thinking it was gonna be a cache but it's not zoom around here bunnies see good things come to those who explore do, 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 do. i love that they do have a visual aid as to like the kind of rough area that you're gonna be looking for I know I touched on that very early on back when we discovered it in the grasslands, but I mean it like that is incredibly helpful. <coughs> Look at him jumping. That's so cute. Okay, let's grab these items. Again, I want to make sure that we transmute everything, but that means that we're probably coming to the end of our transmutation. Whoa. I'd reckon that means we're kind of coming towards the end of it if we only have one more region to explore. And again, I just want to remind people the only reason I I know we have one more area to explore. This is going to be where the final kill is. Or like, you know, when we unlock the secret, the secret creature, this is its layer. Absolutely. Um, is because the Moogle said there's only one more to do, which tells me that there's only one more location, unless there's no more Moogle huts in them. Okay. Let's actually go ahead and, ah, oh, these fiends up here. I was gonna say, how am I supposed to, okay, wait. Let me go to this top, maybe? Let me go to this top, Chocobo, right here, and see if we can go up north from here. Uh, again, I've missed so many. Um... Wait a minute, maybe it's up here. Do you think so? Or is there a way to get down over here? Because I'm not, that's the bridge. Oh, oh, that's a bridge. That's not, I can run through that. Hold on, let me fast travel here and then launch off and then just go under. Yeah. For some reason, I thought that was the, um... Okay, yes, here, here. Oh, 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 stop, don't, ah! Oh, you can get to it by an elevator, by the way. Oh, look, there's our last area. Look how lush it is. Drop? I love that. Like a casual little drop. This is beautiful. Hmm. Activation tower. The last one. This has been a nice, easy area to just take out. Again, like, I feel like I haven't had to try to... Oh! I didn't realize that... Oh, I didn't realize they can do that! right get him get him all right let's go cold front and then we're gonna do a blizzard and just magnify that across the whole field i guess it only magnifies two two others one of this Oh, he can limit! Let's see his limit! <gasps> Magic Mog Box. Meow, 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 meow,
I love it. I love it. I'm really starting to like Kate. Hey, and again, I feel like this was how I was with Red too. Do you guys remember? I was a little like, I don't want to say closed minded, but I feel like again, you have to see what their moves are and you have to lean into those strengths. Granted, I do like him a lot because, oh, posh top, or posh, posh top, posh top. Have we already gotten this one? No. Where's the, we're missing a chocobo. There he is. Sir, what have you been doing? Sir. Hi, I know. He's so beautiful. Uh, let's go ahead and pop squat too. Just rest up. Do. Do. Okay, use the cushion. The wild blue yonder. Oh gosh, okay. I wish we could give them a pillow. Now that I think about it, they just lay there. Grab this. I need to find the other stops in this area. I reckon that could be part of our cleanup crew day where we're trying to get everything. There's probably quite a few regions that have missed a couple things. You know what? We need to fly up there. We need to land on it. It's a little annoying. Oh, no, you don't. No, you don't. Whee! <laughs> oh, I almost missed that, too. Okay, there should be one divine interest, like look over there, divine interest, life spring. Life spring will open up the enemy for this area. Life spring? Yep. Oh. Oh, and we have a, yeah, yeah, yeah. Spirit waste tower done. All of our towers? Check. Easy. Fly down here. Come on, Chocobo. Let's go. Jared. So many Moogle medals. Okay, let's hop over. Let's go this way. Life spring here. Okay, the life spring we have to actually go, I think, around. Or we might need to go up here. No. Because this literally just takes you over to the tower. Hold on. But I do think you have to go this direction. Yeah, I think you have to go up and around. Oh, oh, divine. Divine blocks. Yep, up here. That was a There are sites here dedicated to a Bahamut oh. variant. A variant known as Bahamut Arisen. Arisen. With armored scales red as the canyon soil and an engine born of flesh mounted on Oh. Sorry, Chadley. I didn't do it. Here we go, last one, and then we should go challenge him right away. Yeah, we should have a Chadley break between all the exploration. I'll finish this like northern area, then we'll go take a Chadley break. I love it. X square triangle, XX square triangle X. Oh my gosh. <coughs> X square tri X square triangle, XX square triangle X. Okay, I'm just gonna try it. <clears throat> X square triangle, X, X square triangle, X. Oh, I missed it, but I did hit it. I did, I oh, I just missed it though, but okay, doesn't count. X square triangle, X, X square triangle, X. That ain't bad. All right, we got a new one. I wanna stop. I want us to try to take out summons and just really try to acquire all the ones that we've gotten so far. We interrupt this program. Well, let me go grab let me go grab the other things in this region real quick. You have now analyzed all the summon crystals in the Cosmo Canyon region. Yes. Good work. I must confess I have reservations about making Bahamut Arisen any stronger. I cannot decide if this development is positive or terrifying. Terrifying. Ah, though you have yet to obtain the requisite materia, as I recall, you'll first need to confront the divine via the combat mm -hmm. simulator. Naturally. Okay, let's hop back over here. Or we can't get to that life spring yet. But let me just choke a bow here. I love the music in Choc each of the divine regions too. Oh. 
Okay, so let's go this location. There, it's gotta be up here. Wait, no, this was the chocobo stop. No, we have to get up top, and that's gonna be hard to do. But we do wanna make sure we're exploring this whole area too, and let's go ahead and just check off that fiend while we're here. And then, we'll get that life spring. The Shapeless Assassin. His lucky as Pressure in the claws. Rare Basilisk variant Oh, detected. Basilisk. Commencing guidance protocol. Should be basilisk freeze. Oh my. The color of their skin to blend into the so certainly rare. Prey undetected. Shinra is studying this fiend in the hopes of rep. Replicating its camouflage capabilities. This variant. Yeah, it does camouflage. That's what we saw it doing. Yeah. It manipulates the properties of its skin in accordance with the temperature, humidity, and lighting of its surroundings. It's Look at their eyes, like, bobbing you know. out. Be sure to rely on all your senses if you don't want to lose track of it. Okay, let's do it. Get him! First strike. Come on. Okay, we're gonna need to scan him still, but let's go ahead and do that blizzard on one of them. Woo, let's do some steel skin. Hang back. You know, I have not been doing this at all. All right, we did pressure him toe to stagger. Let me assess first. Let's do it right. Oh, we know how to stagger. What am I doing? Oh no. There we go, this one's the stagger one. We're gonna stagger that one. Uh, let me just make sure I'm doing this right. I got this. Uh oh, he dodged. He's going, he's getting close. They're getting close. He's staggered, nice. Now we just need to kill them all within a minute. So to do that, okay, Kate is down bad. Hold on, let me do a, let me do a mega potion on Kate. I wanna go back to Kate and then do Blizzard level two. Nice. I'm gonna get a prey going on. Staggered back to back, back to back staggers. Overcharge him. Nice. Then go pray. And then we'll finish him with this. ATB. Beautiful. I think we have one more, one more Fiend Intel. Two, three more. Wait, three more Fiend Intels? Dang, I guess I had taken, I thought I had taken out so many more. But yeah, no. Well, we'd have the, the Uber one. The Uber one's always going to be the most difficult to acquire. But what else? All right, we'll choke a bow over here. I'm on a choke a bow. You're on a choke a bow. All right. Oh my gosh. Get your tail feathers out of my face. All right, so we need to be up top and I really do think the only way to get up. Ah, get away. See, we need to land on that. Wait, 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 wait. We need to be up there, which means we need to land on that platform which means we have rabbits. Hold on, sniff, sniff. Do, 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 do. Hmm. You know what though? I do kind of want to keep all of this together. Like I was thinking about it. I know that I want to break. I really do want to do Chadley's missions, but I actually want to be able to like, I want this to be all kind of time stamped out and you know exploring Cosmo Canyon then we can have Chadley time then we can have side mission time you know like I think I want to be able to break it up for you guys like that I'm looking for the thing to toss us up toss me wait a minute maybe it's back over here I see all of those let's go this direction should be something that kind of lifts us into the get out of here Get out of here. Mm. This is all new. Okay, I can see all of those. Wait, what is this? Whoa, it's the ghee statues. Ghee remnants. Remnants of the ghee. Nope, this is not gonna work. We need to find a launch pad. Oh, wait, right there. Here we go. Ooh, wait, what's up here? Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Oh, nice. You gotta explore every single crevice. I think our characters are doing fine. Let me see. 
Oh yeah, it's just, uh, I'll do a high potion for Kate. Yeah, Kate takes, takes a lot more damage than the others. Kate's a little, yeah, look at the, well, Kate actually doesn't have that much less health. Okay, so from here, let me think how I wanna do this. Well, we do need to launch over there for something else, wait. Maybe that's how I get to snaps and stuff. But we primarily want to launch this way. Okay. And swoop. Beautiful. And this should be our life spring. We should see a hawk here soon. No, wait, wait, wait. The life spring's there. Oh, snap. This isn't it. We gotta go even further up. Back to back gliding ranges. This is like a whole path. It's almost like the training course that she talked about. There's a couple boxes, but otherwise this feels, this feels excessive. There must be something that brings us back this way later on, maybe? Like maybe a side mission, because this is a lot of just like back to back to back. We need to get up there. Look at that. What is that? I've seen those in a couple different locations, but I have no idea what that is. Huh. I can't figure it out yet, but we can come back to it. We can launch ourselves over. Okay, so we need to go the distance. No, do. Look at the observatory from, oh, well, you can't see it now, but that was cool. I do like these platforms. The whole system of traveling, it's just so enjoyable. I hated the buggy the most, like you guys saw that. The buggy for me, it was like clunky. It felt like you had to get out of it all the time and it just took so much, I don't know, it took so much longer. Maybe that's me being impatient. Probably, it's probably not a good sign. I can't wait like two seconds longer to get out of a buggy. Uh, some of these might be the proto relics too, by the way. I didn't even think about that, but yeah, some of these locations might be the proto relic. Nice little platform area. But it's up further. Oh, there it is. Shrouded ruins life spray. This is pretty. What happens to the hawks once you find the area? Do they finally feel at peace? Are they good? Are they happy? What nobody thinks about the hawks. All right, let's go find this fiend. We already know where his lair is. And actually, I think that concludes this upper area. Life spring data complete. Proto relics, what we're missing. We gotta find that proto relic. <laughs> Here at Blood Cloud, I've uncovered the location of a dangerous fiend. A vicious dragon seems to have awakened in the Cosmo Clovers. Canyon region. You must slay it, ere the fair earth is dyed an even darker mm. red. And where is the wyvern? I wonder where. Yeah, it's right there. Oh, actually, we should go ahead and do some of the other feed intels too. Okay, so we have, well, first of all, I do want to clear this region. That's going to kill me if I don't. So I do want to like fly off of here and clear that. We got to get to this fiend. So a lot of the stuff that we have to get to are just upper platform areas. So once we figure out how to navigate those, we'll be good to go. But I got to run to the bathroom. Okay, so let's zoom down again, clear that kind of cloudy area and try to get to this guy. There's gotta be a platform somewhere up here that you can land on it. Or maybe we, I don't know. We'll figure it out. It'll buff out. Excuse me, excuse me. Okay, so we need a platform too. Sure. Oh, actually I can, whoop, whoop, whoop. All right, hold on. Wrong area, Cosmo Canyon. I need to zoom this way. I think. Yeah, this is like the area that I didn't explore. Drop. All right, and then we're at it. I saw those, I did, I know, I know. Me ignoring them, I know. Okay, we just got that. 
You know what? Let's try to go to one of these main platforms and launch ourselves up from there. Or I have an idea. How far away is it? That's pretty far. Actually, though, that might not be out of our reach. Let me go to this launch pad. Let's check this out. And instantly keep this up. And we are trying to go all the way over here. So we need to hug. Is it that platform? No, there's no way. Okay, now we're, we need to straighten out a little bit. It should be... I think we're going to make it. I think we might do it. Also, again, look, that's got to be proto-relic stuff. Which means I shouldn't go to it until we find the other area first. Okay, we're coming in hot. This is good. We'll save the wyvern for the very last of this area. Yep, nice drop. Oh! I probably, well, I mean, I probably preemptively dropped. Everybody falling off with me. Okay, let me get on this boat. Nice. Drop down, please. Here we go. Woo! Break. My oh, this is perfect. The presence of a but I still need to get up top. Life form. Rare ski -ski they kind of look like cloud. <laughs> Rare ski ski. Stagger and unleash a limit attack. Not that black market dealers cared. Given this tragic, bloody history, one can oh, hardly God. fault these ski skis for their highly aggressive these behavior skis. when one of their own is taken from them. Loath though I am to subject them to further trauma, mm. I'm afraid this is the only way that we, we might learn, learn more. more about them. Please try to be as gentle as you can. <sighs> okay. Let's do it. <laughs> Get in there. Wallop him. Whoa, enough is enough. They're pissed. I'm hoping that I can, um, I gotta remember, I'm thinking it might be Blizzard, but it might not be. How am I supposed to unleash a limit attack? Okay, I'm not gonna use any special abilities. Kate Sith is already kind of built up, so I'm gonna... I'm gonna do Kate. Yeah, I'm gonna try to get Kate. Yeah, look at that. Look at that. Kitty Wallop is really building it up. In fact, I think that's like what it's meant for. Nice. There we go. Limit. Beautiful. Oh, I gotta call forth my Moogle first. I can't do it without my Moogie. Okay. There we go. Now I'll limit. Doesn't matter. Not so hard. Okay, 30 seconds, 30 seconds. Now, drop kick. Let's do kaboom. And then let's bop that guy. Let's get him with a uh, focus shot. Hold on. Hit him with the fire. Oh, I didn't assess him. 15 seconds. Nice. Kate, Kate is like my ride or die in this area. Mm. That was really good. We're also almost party level eight, so everybody's gonna level up here. Yeah. Thank you, thank you. One glance at the data will tell you they are clearly no match for him. I probably have a little high level for this area, maybe. You haven't noticed. I'm trying to have a conversation with Cloud, so please quit playing. Cloud! He does that all the time. <laughs> know that another combat trial Flower awaits of Destruction. Yeah, we need to catch up on all of Chadley's stuff. This is going to be the episode we do it, you guys. Y'all are going to get a long Saturday episode. All right, so let's go ahead and clear this area. Nonetheless, let's go ahead and go this way. Oh, I think I can go. To oh, wait, but I'm trying to get up there. Can I get up to there from here? Do I have to fly and land? I think I have to fly and land. We can go back and get it. Let's go up that. Yeah, I'm going to go this way. 
Let me get boosted up here. A sprig of oregano. Ah, uh, see, it's not gonna be enough. I need something else. Where's like the balloons? Okay, wait. I need to launch from a higher location. Yeah, that's unfortunate. Okay, just drop. Man. I do feel like we're missing some of their caches in this area too. Okay, let me go this way. We need to go from that middle platform, like the massive platform right there. Okay, drop down. Oh, bunnies, bunnies, bunnies. Nice. Proto relic. Gonna go get that proto relic. If it's the last thing I do. See, yeah, we have to launch from that highest top. Hmm. Destination reached, cleared. Let me go to the right side, the left side. Okay, now we're done with all of this. We do need to clear a path right there. I know it doesn't in the grand scheme of things matter, but I just can't in good faith leave it. Also, we want to take, oh, Chocobo stop. Where is it, baby? Back here. See, I knew we were missing some. Just felt like there were only like two in the whole region. Thank you. Actually, I think I should pop a squad. I think my characters are kind of low after that last one. Plus, we're gonna end up doing another one here soon. <coughs> oh, now I remember what made the Cosmo Canyon so, or um, Corel to me, I think was really annoying because of the proto relics. I liked the mini game proto relics. I didn't like the doing the challenges, like the fighting challenges with characters. That just was not my forte. Gollum, 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 Gollum. Gollum, Gollum. Ah, uh, okay. We are so close to this proto relic. Whoa, this must be it. Yeah. Plantologist ruins. Here I was thinking it was up top, it's I not. I see you're approaching the signal. The source appears to be somewhere in the canyon. The ruins. ruins. We'll have to keep exploring the ruins. These ruins are closely connected with the life stream, and it's thought that they were created mm. to help guide it through the veil. I have complete faith your efforts will greatly aid our planet. Okay. To just be in the presence of the Nanaki is such an honor. The Nanaki. Oh. Wait, wait, wait. <laughs> what? Bacteria, I smell? No. Oh, there's more people here. <laughs> Y'all know how I feel. Whoa. Yeah, this is, yeah. What are we supposed to do? Yuffie, the little sister that nobody asked for. What is she doing? Oh, we got to talk to the people first. Oh my gosh! Yuffie! Nile! What are they Nile! doing here? It's so good to see you! You too! We were worried you might not have made it out in time. Nothing can wow. this uh, <laughs> Clearly. Hmm? Guys, from Say, the DLC! Where's Sonon? Um... Yeah... Hey! You three! Oh, Splinter Cell. Well, where are my manners? I These miss guys are from Avalanche so HQ. Much. They're the ones who helped me out back in Midgar. And I don't think they need an introduction. Y'all were at the Shinra building, weren't you? Tell me. Was Wedge with you? Aww. Or did you see him? <sighs> Same reaction if as Sonon. Tell me anything, anything at all, please. Wedge. I wasn't expecting this. I'm sorry. Don't be. Just... I need to know. Oh. After the Sector 7 plate fell, 
the things we saw and heard. Mm. All the carnage. It was hell. We wanted to help. We really did. But how? It all seemed so hopeless. That's when the call came. From the folks at Avalanche HQ. We learned it was the company that dropped the plate. And that they were going to drop another. Unless we stopped them. Yeah. HQ needed volunteers. To help storm the Shinra building. And this was our chance. We knew it was the right thing to do. All of us. Wedge and I ended up being assigned to the same truck. It's so crazy to... We'll infiltrate the building via the underground parking facility. From there, we make our way up, taking each and every floor. Hmm. Yeah, it's so crazy to remember we that... Lost contact with Lucia's team. I think we have to assume... Uh, that's enough. That there's so much more of Avalanche than just we'll our group. With Matt. On it. Matt. Let He's got a sandwich. <laughs> I'm Wedge with the Splinter Cell. Uh, Barrett's crew, right? Mm -hmm. Here, uh, try one of these. It'll help you calm down. Oh. Thank you. Go on, eat up. Take the napkin off, buddy, you know? That's a great bread to like inside ratio, you Our know? Team was heading upstairs to take out the president. I know what you're thinking. Doesn't All do those that. stairs, PTSD. The <laughs> the <rules changed>. <laughs> <sighs> Come on, man. Get the lead out. Don't want to be left behind. Hey, thanks for the assist. Come on, Wedge. <laughs> <Help me out. laughs> All right, we're almost there, boys. At long last, we're gonna take back our world, find the bastards who stole it, and send them to hell. Mm. Yeah. yeah. The one dude doesn't even have any weapons. I've got friends up there who need to know we're coming. Oh, uh, oh the guy. Sorry, but I didn't. Want them to get hurt, sir. The guy that was in, yeah, the library, right? Yeah, they're insurgent or the um, kind of spy. I'll catch up, Ray. We were all fired up, ready to fight. Yeah, he was in the library. Remember, he was the sweet old man. Hmm. Does the audio sound weird during this part, or is that just me? Oh. I think it just feels a little muffled compared to the rest. <laughs> oh, Wedge did it. But the good fates, those are the good fates, aren't they? Aren't those the good fates? No. I couldn't believe it. It was him. Thank you. <laughs> Damn it. Don't worry. It's all good, bro. Huh? What? Hey, y'all heard that, right? That was Wedge. He went back to Aaron, the live stream. Those who pass on become one with the live stream. I know what you thought you heard, but it was probably just the wind. <laughs> no, it was coming from that. Whatever. Right? In times past, the Cetra came to fonts like these to give thanks to the life stream. There aren't many left, so we wanted to help preserve the few still standing. It felt like the least we could do, you know? For all those who returned to the planet. I guess that makes sense. Hey, that still feels kind of like shaky why, why they're here, here, I guess, to Help be. Them spruce things up. 
there anything we can do for we you? We need to get cats in here. I don't know. <laughs> Restore the planetary fonts? They're this region's main source of energy. And kind of like relief valves for the life stream. But when they're as busted as this one here, you can't even get close to do repairs. Mm. Mako's way too dense. So we figured we'd use a probe. Fix the fonts remotely. What? <laughs> it's, it's like Wally. -E. Thing is, little guy's just too old. Probably better off in a junkyard than with us. Chadley, yes. Perhaps I can be of service? Absolutely. Robotics is one of my areas of expertise. Meet Robot Chadley. <laughs> Or Robo-Chad, <laughs> if you prefer something to bring. Robo-Chad. At any rate, you should now have complete control over him. Go on, ask him to do something. Okay. Um, what do we want to ask him to do? I don't think that is something that we've really talked about at length, is why are components or creations by Shinra helping us? Is it the whole concept of like they are sentient to the point that they also feel like the planet needs to be protected and they see what the wrong that's being done? In Gears and Gambits, you must program robots with gambits and actions, then send them into battle with an aim of reaching the center and vanquishing the enemy leader. Okay. Yes. Another mini game? A new mini game. Not just another one, guys, a new one. Gears and Gambits. What? Oh, shoot. You know what that means. I forgot that we have to go. What? Gears and Gambits. Preparing for battle. Three types of robots can be deployed. Oh, no. It's like a version of... It feels like whatchamacallit. King Flan. Okay. Each operating in accordance with its gambits and actions, which are programmed prior to battle. Gambits determine a target. Actions determine what the robot will do to the target. For the first battle, let's use an AI set up by Chadley. Press to begin. Okay. All right. Portal skills. So you've got... Robots can be deployed from any of the three portals and will then move along their lane toward an enemy leader in the center. Press to view each available robot's gambits and actions. The icons above the foe's HP gauge indicate its elemental weaknesses. Okay, its elemental weakness. Try to deploy the robots that can exploit these vulnerabilities. Type 1, effective foes against ice, fire, and then lightning. Okay. So we want to deploy a lightning one. The ATB gauge at the bottom left slowly fills. And once it has been reached to required amount, you can deploy another robot. The ATB cost of each robot varies according to the gambits and actions. Try deploying another unit once the ATB gauge is successfully full. Oh, you have to be able to assess. Okay. So now we want one successful against fire. Fire shot. Thunder shot. Nice! Okay. And I can rotate over. As you can see, pressing L2 or R2 switches between portals. This allows you to deploy robots in other lanes and outmaneuver the enemy. Three portals share an HP gauge. Oh, okay, okay. Okay. So now we're actually able to fire at... Do we, uh, do we have the power to assess? Pressing allows you to view information on the enemy unit, such as their gambits and actions. The same method can be used to view the robot's remaining ability uses. Okay, so we're assessing him. He's got 25 phase shift, reconfigure, barrier, mighty splat, vicious bite, uses potent attacks when several robots are deployed in a single lane. Ooh, okay. So we want to switch over and we want to deploy like, I don't know, a tier one. And then maybe we want to deploy, oh, wait, we need an anti-frost. Go over here. You can assess the special abilities shared between the portals by pressing square or triangle. He used to select a specific skill. Oh, okay. Whoa. Region or deals a large amount of damage. Or do we restore? Oh, okay. This is so cool. So like, for example, let's say, well, I don't think we want to heal yet, but hold on. Let me do a fire troop. Now we want to heal. Hold on. Now we want to do a regen right here. And now we want to get a, whoa. 
Like your robots, some foes have advanced actions of their own, such as enemies designated by one. So make sure to assess them to trigger the advanced. Okay. None, all weaknesses. Wait, wait, okay, so all. Foe, bite, use thunder against Robux to weaken the lightning. Okay. I think I understand it. I think it's still a little... I don't have any more portal skills. I'm gonna go ahead and launch a fire. Get some, get some stuff going. We can't do a portal skill yet. I wonder, nice. Currently targeted by five foes. Remember you must defeat the enemy leader with the allotted amount of time. That's what's gonna be difficult. Okay, that's a flan king. Oh my gosh. I think we've got this. I think we've got it, yeah. Let's do another fire. Just take that guy out. Get more on it. One, two, splat. What? He's really bopping us. So I guess you can only use two portal skills each go. I'd say do a lightning. Oh shoot, I needed to do a lightning right there. Let's do a lightning here. He's trying to go to my portal. We need a freeze, we need a frost. We need a frost giant. Okay, this is not bad. This is gonna be fun. I like this. We gotta run to all the proto relics. It's gonna be hard though to, to beat it in that time limit, I think. Lightning. Get the lightning, get the lightning. But this is why you have to use for multiple different lanes, you know? Yeah, look at that. Woo! I love that. Okay, this is gonna be good. This is gonna be so much fun. But I think I have to do the real one. Wasn't that just training or Chadley already assigned it? Oh, also, you're gonna place different troops, right? Wow. It's a shame the others ain't here to see this. What did it turn Who into? Says they're not. Oh, now it's green. It's no longer red. What's that? This is helping the planet. I believe that light will lead us to another set of ruins. Yeah. Oh, well, the light, but. This has to be helping the planet. And Look at the wind. Font to fix too, I'll bet. Is it okay if we tag along? Sure, why not? Whoa. Whatever beef I've got with you HQ kids, <laughs> the planet's welfare takes priority. Wow. I'm actually really kind of shocked by the turn of events. I am so, okay, this is finally like another enjoyable proto relic. I think the proto relics to me have just been pretty lackluster or just my, probably just my least favorite. Okay, we know exactly how to get there. Yeah, I I remember that specifically. So we just need to go to, I think this launch pad should do. Wow. Wow, Um. yes. We just have to go over here. It's probably gonna be more difficult than it seems, so I'm not gonna, that was like round one, it seemed a little bit easy. Is everybody on Chocobo back with us? Or are they just gonna show up whenever we get to the font? I guess let's check behind us. Let me see. No, they're not on Chocobo back yet, but they'll probably show up whenever we get to the font. Got these. Don't fall off the edge, y'all. Thank you. Next one will be the true test because it's without Chadley's help. But it seemed really complicated at first, but it feels like it has similar mechanics to, kind of similar concept to uh, Fort Condor, right? You've got like, this trumps that. You've got to know what's susceptible to what. Mm-hmm. Okay, they should be here. From my study of ancient texts, I've deduced this place was built by the Cetra to house something Alien. Alien. Precisely what is unclear. I remember hearing about this growing up. You don't think they were talking about the Gi, do you? Hmm. hmm. Possibly. Perhaps, but the energy signature would suggest otherwise. Given that it so strongly resembles that of a proto-relic, I surmise these structures were designed to contain one. For now, let's continue to restore them. I'm sure we'll find something within. The planet itself is guiding us. This one feels. I've also developed an additional AI oh. chip for RoboChat. Hopefully, it expedites our work. This one feels less selfishly motivated to getting the proto relic and more about the planet. Like this feels very appropriate for the region and everything. Like I just, I really am enjoying this one. 
Let me go in here real quick. And the minigame. Okay, maybe it has a lot to do with the minigame, but still. All right, put us in. Let's go. Gears and Gambits. GG's. <coughs> Let's go. Okay, you can now program your robots with gambits and actions. Gambits determine a target. Actions determine what the robot will do to the target. To enhance your chances of victory, reference the information on the enemy units before programming your robots, which can be done pressing X. You can also auto-program your robots if stage is giving you trouble, if a stage is giving you trouble. As Chadley proceeds with his research, more gambits and actions will become available. Oh gosh, that's a lot. There's a lot happening. Okay, let's set stuff. So, each robot has several AI slots into which gambits and actions can be programmed. Once a robot is deployed, it will act accordingly to its AI. Yeah. The order in which programmed. Okay. Gambits determine the target as well as conditions under which actions trigger, such as an enemy's elemental affinity or a robot's remaining HP. Actions allow the robot to perform many functions, such as increasing its HP, healing allies. Oh, okay. Okay. That's kind of fun. Yeah, look at this. Gambits will allow robots to target foes, allies, or itself, and it's important to choose according to situations likely to occur in battle. For basic offensive strategy, try setting separate gambits for both nearby and far by foes. Okay. Whoa. Okay, so I guess I'll do... Self? Plan ahead when choosing actions. Those that exploit elemental weaknesses are a good start, but it is also worth considering a preemptively attack, land with a finishing blow, and effectively use healing to support actions. In some cases, certain actions will be incompatible with a target specified by a gambit. If you cannot find the action you wish to set, try changing the gambit. Once you have decided on an action to use, press X to select it. Note that if you wish to prioritize an action, such as healing, place it at the top AI slot. That's... okay. That's a lot. There's a lot happening. I'm gonna actually go with, yeah. And then I don't, I don't know, none. I guess you can only do none there. This is against lightning or this is against fire. Wait, this is my lightning one. Elemental weakness, fire shot. No, no, no. But it's susceptible to lightning. Okay, that's kind of important to know. Let's do foe weak to an element. Fire shot. And for this one, maybe we do missile. And then none. Okay, so I can't do any for those. And then a tier three robot is a thunder shot. But you could technically have one that's like a healer. Like this one can be modify health and cost. I don't know, I'm gonna try this. Okay. Oh, portal skills. Okay, so we can do deals a moderate amount of damage, deals a large amount of damage, or we can do defensive. Regenja, Regenga. Cautious courage enhances attack power and defense. It's kind of fun. I like the hybrid though. I like the hybrid. Okay, I think we're good to go. Enemy leader intel, King Flan. Use potent attacks when several robots are deployed in a lane. Uh, assess any marshmallows that appear to know how to avoid triggering their attack. Okay. I think I, I think I get it. We'll see. Okay, so lightning, we need a counter lightning. That's a king too, so we're gonna want double thunder shots. Now I wanna save up. I gotta really watch out my um, ATB. I gotta save my ATB before we do anything. Oh, my poor little lightning guy. Get him. Nice. The missile was good. The missile was good. Okay, he hasn't deployed anything yet. Okay, he's going lightning, which we still have one lightning guy, so I'm actually going to let that... Well, yeah, he's going down. He's going down. Actually, let's do it. Last use. Recover projectile. Okay, they're going on the flan. Let's go ahead and drop a fire here. Do a portal uh no we need to wait until more let's go ahead and drop a freeze right here oh shoot oh wait that's amazing 
I actually really lucked out with that. A fire on a fire. Oh, shoot, but I need a frost. I need a frost. Hold on, let me portal skill. Let me go right here and do Comet. Wait, I think I just did regen. Did I do Comet or regen? I did regen, that was so bad. I'm gonna Comet. Okay, Comet just came down. I don't have anything else. That was kind of, I feel like, foolish. Currently targeted by five foes, amazing damage. We're just gonna save up that uh, ATB. All right, yeah, so we're gonna need a anti-fire on this side. Oh, he's wrecking them. Nice. We want a, we need to assess, we need to assess. Has no elemental weakness, performs a special attack when certain conditions have been met. <gasps> I guess we'll just lightning. Phase shift reinforcements. Oh my gosh, I'm going down, guys. I should have saved my special attacks. I am going down. Oh, that's a freeze. Oh, I'm going down. Hold on. There is no way. Hold on, I gotta stop this guy. Has no elemental weakness. Oh my gosh. Reinforcements. I should have known they'd have specials too. What was I thinking? We're gonna need to restart that. We're gonna need to restart. 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 What? Yeah, so I'm trying to understand like the elementals I can do. I guess if you don't have. So I guess that's why you really want to. Let me go into here. Foe. These, so these are like normal. These are normal foes. So maybe for some of them, you don't want them to be focused. Like, so my tier three robot, right? I'm not gonna do a Thundershot. I'm actually just gonna do foe and do like a Lariat, and then second will be Thundershot. You know what I mean? Like, I wonder if, I wonder if that will be good. Okay. Me trying to figure this out right now. Okay, let that ATB save. And on top of it, I definitely wanna make sure that I'm just relaxing. He's going Lariat first, which is not ideal, but it's okay, it's okay. See, he's Lariat first and then he's shot after. See, that makes him not even that good, though. But I guess he'll be good later on. He's regenerating like crazy. Ugh. See, that's the problem, is if they're susceptible to that. So I don't like that. I mean, he just got, like, half of my HP. It doesn't mean I can't come back from it, but... I have to outlast that elemental damage, you know? I'm gonna go fire here. And freeze here. And then save up ATB. Wow, lucked out. Go another fire here. So we survived that lane and we do have a lot of um, great enemies that aren't just susceptible to. Let's do freeze there. Let's do a, I'm not going to do a comment until he calls in reinforcements. Yeah, I'm definitely going to wait this one out. It's about the long game. A minute 42, currently targeted by five foes. He's doing that. Maybe we should do... Okay, he's in a fire lane. Let me cast that. I might want to get a heal here soon. <coughs> okay, that is nothing. So we're going to want to throw in a robot like that. And then I'm actually going to... I still need to wait for him to do normal reinforcements. Okay, we want to do a fire in here. That Lariat should get in there and really do some damage. I think, I think, I don't know. <sighs> it's probably not the right time to do a Comet. Freeze. A minute left. I mean, that's going to be really hard to get in there with damage, you know? It's going to be so hard. He's doing, he's gonna do. See, I'm not playing this right. Freeze on freeze. I have heal, but the heal's not gonna be effective. No, I don't know, like, I get it and I don't get it, you know? Like, it's, it's both, it makes sense and it doesn't make sense. 
I'm gonna have to get a robot over here. I just am not gonna be able to target them. I mean, those two little two guys are lariating, so that's good. That's a lariat right there. I feel like I'm talking about a truck. <laughs> I'm just going all in. I need to do a regen right there. I gotta get these heals going. The Lariat is good. The Lariat's good. We're gonna want to get like a fire guy in there. Go, go, go! I should have saved my heal. Come on, guys! 16 seconds! No! There's no way. There's no way. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Okay, that would have been a great offensive, but I needed to outlast longer. If I had a couple more seconds. Dang. Okay, let me retry. Let's try to do... See, I, I semi-understand it, but... Uses potent attacks when several near... Okay, when several robots are deployed in a single lane. So I need to make sure I'm not deploying too many robots in a lane. Yeah. See, I feel like there were a lot of lightnings, so I definitely need to go back to... Priority lightning. Foe element weakness. Weak element weakness priority. No. I need to take this off and do... So, Lariat, and then this one will be, this one will be Elemental Weakness Priority with Thundershot. Okay. I think. This one I'm like pretty happy with. But it's always Fire Shot. So what if it's like Elemental Weakness Priority Fire Shot? And then it's Missile. But we could do, we could do, I do like the missiles. And then I have a Lariat here. I have two Lariats and missiles. Thank you, shot. I'm gonna do, I think, I don't like the Comet that much. I'm gonna try this one. I'm gonna try this one. Okay. I'm gonna try this. I don't know. I don't know. Don't look at me like that. Y'all know it takes me a while to learn these. All right, let's get lightning in here. Gorgeous. Get it. Get it. We need to make sure we don't drop any more enemies after this. Get that fire. And now just save up ATB. Okay, we want to make sure we do not get the missiles, but don't put any more allies there. This is probably going to be a fire, so I'm going to place... I think it's always the same. And that usually is deployed. Oh, okay. The thunder's good. The thunder's good. Thunder will be fine. Thunder's fine. I'm gonna place a freeze here. Yeah, we're getting some damage on that now. Okay. Okay, this is good. This is good. Now we just save up that ATB for whatever happens next. Okay, let's use a regen on that area. Let's go over here, deploy another fire. Two fires on the king. I like it. I wonder if I can almost like blitz too. I'll wait just a little bit. Freeze. Actually, I do kind of want to blitz because if I do blitz, if I blitz them, then we might be able to just rush him and we won't have to even worry about it, you know? He's doing haste. He's got a lot of land in there. Lariats. It was maybe too preemptive for me to do... No, 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 this is good. This is good, this is good. There's too many in that lane, so I need to be careful. I need to go fire over here. Okay. Nice. It would have been nice to have heal right now. I think I should have probably healed. But it's okay. That's gonna be too many in that lane, I think. It's fine, though. I've got these guys firing. Get him, get him, get him. One, two, splat. Get him, missile last. And get it, little guy. Get it! Get it, buddy! Hit him! Do it! Do it! Do it! No! Get in there! Get in there! Come on, you got it, Papa! I gotta save up more frost. Get it with a missile! 
Hit him one more time! Come on! Missile use! Oh my gosh. Woo! Okay, let's go. Did it take us a little bit? Yes, but that was fun. Okay, once you kind of have it down, I'm kind of getting it. I'm kind of not. Let's be honest, I'm brute forcing. Let's just we say all what we're all thinking. Coming out to see the canyon one day. Oh, yeah. That night at the bar, remember? Yeah. You guys were trying some new cocktails for me. The Cosmo Canyon cocktail. Mmm. Yep. This is the one. <laughs> Jesse. Bartender, whip me up another Costa del Sol. Whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> I'm cutting you off. <laughs> Come on, one more couldn't hurt. Now me, I'm a Cosmo Canyon guy. Mm, that one was pretty good, but it was missing that special. Bigs could still see it. Flourish. Guess what I got? Huh? Ta da! That special Cosmo flourish. Salt. Can't call it a Cosmo Canyon without a touch of local flavor, right? Trust me, a dash of this will make all the difference. What's Cosmo about it? It's mined from the canyon itself, the birthplace of planetology, and pretty hard to come by, I'll have you know. <laughs> oh my god. That cell's gotta be laced with something. Wow! <laughs> <laughs> You're right! Wow! It's like a whole new drink. Can it really make that big of a difference? Too bad the stuff is so hard to come by. If only I had more. One day we'll go. I thought you might say that. Oh. But out the whole store so you can keep on mixing. <laughs> but those will only last us so long. Especially if this Cosmo Canyon becomes a hit. Gonna need to stock up. In that case, what about a trip to the source, huh? <laughs> we could all bring back as much salt as we could carry. What do you say? It's the music Can't more than it. anything. All my planetology, here we come! It's gonna be great! Oh, really? Huh? Y'all think we got money to <laughs> field trips? Because our books say otherwise. Try it. Huh? <laughs> Shit, we gotta go. <laughs> There you have it. The boss himself says it's a done deal. To our generous leader. <laughs> to to Barrett. Barrett. Honestly, y'all are just too much. <laughs> <laughs> they were so much fun. Like, it was such a good group. Look, guys, we made it. <laughs> Would have liked to have gotten here sooner, but... <laughs> <coughs> Wait, yeah, they didn't have chocobos. Is it already? <laughs> Ages ago, slow pokes. Come on, double time. On to the next. <laughs> Polk. Coming. Best of friends. I just, um... I know that no story feels genuine if you don't have like, I mean, I don't want to say genuine if you don't have a few deaths. Like, I don't want it to feel like that morbid, but I just miss them so much. And I only experienced them in the remake, you know? Like, I don't even know their presence in the OGs or the OG, but they were just such powerful characters in the group. And it was like what brought the group together and made it feel alive. Barrett's big on tough love, huh? <sighs> Maybe I ought to try to return the favor. <laughs> there was apparently a thriving salt industry here, back before everything went to hell with the fall of the Republic. Oh, Wait, but this was pre-Republic. Sea, right? Does that mean this whole place used to be underwater? Wow. The planet's just full of surprises. Mm. Seeing these ruins, I can't help wondering what this place yeah. must have looked like when it was first built. Magnificent. I never imagined I'd get this invested, but here we are. <laughs> the music in this segment, too. I think that's what it is. Like, the music in this game is so incredibly powerful. Oh, they might be up for score. 
they might be up for best score for this year. Um, I think FF16 was for the last year. So the game itself is hard, but um, it's worth it. It's so worth it for these little glimpses of the memories of what once was. So we have another one. Is it up there? It's up there. Oh no. Where's my chocobo? I'm gonna have to figure out how to get there. Cause it's not gonna be by normal means. Like you're not gonna be able to climb to it. You're gonna have to, we're gonna have to fly from uh, maybe the, maybe the Mog's tool. Let me try here. Is this on the bottom or is this on the top? Um, I'm trying to make it over here. That's just gonna take us over, but that, well, I can see it. We can't go this direction. Hmm. Um, to get over there, I mean, or you could fly from somewhere higher, somewhere taller. Um, gliding ranges. Wait a minute. That's a gliding range too, but that's to get over there. No. Okay, let me try to go over here. Let me try here to there. Cause I guess maybe I've never glided over there. No, I think I did. I did glide over there because that's what took us to the boat. Man, this whole gliding process is a little... Yeah, because I'm not going to hit that. So you don't come from this way. There has to be a... There has to be something up even higher. Maybe the Mog Stool? These are the ones I came from. Maybe here? What is that little... Wait! Oh my gosh, you can get to it. Wait a minute, I think you can get to it. I think I'm being a goofy. I'm being absolutely goofy. Ignore me. Ignore me. Hold on. Oh, I could have gotten to the excavation area. I'm being such a goofball. You can, you just have to go around the side. I was like, I don't think you can get to this. And they wouldn't make you if you couldn't. Well, obviously, if you can't, but... Like, they wouldn't make it that difficult, is what I'm trying to say. I think. I think. Yeah, and then you go up here. Don't. <laughs> I'm gonna keep blaming it on being sick. Hey, they got- they finally got, uh, chocobos! Ah, it was a climbing situation. I think that means there are two more fiends, three more fiends, and two more proto-relics. Oi! Hop off. You're in a chocobo. Okay. There you are. They got here first. I'm impressed. Well, there well. you are. Y'all beat us to the punch for once. Yeah. Not that it Suspicious. Matters. We still can't reach the font. And there's a weird fiend. You got a any fiend. smart ideas? A weird fiend? Chadley always does. <laughs> Chadley to the Ask rescue. And you shall receive. I've prepared an additional AI chip. There we go. It should allow you to progress further. Just mind the monsters. Okay, so maybe it's not a flan anymore. Maybe it's something completely different. It's gotta be a new kind of creature. Thanks, Robo Chad. Oh, this one's gonna be hard. This one's probably gonna be the hardest one yet. I'm sure they scale, like, was as you get to like Proto Relic 4. Also, we haven't seen that guy in a while. Whatever happened to King Flan? In order to hit the flying whips, set gravity shot or missile, which will ground them. Okay, so let's have one with a one with. Hold on. The lightnings are always the cheapest to deploy and they have the most. Foe airborne. Gravity shot. Okay, and then we'll go with this and then we'll do foe. Airborne foe pri- wait, let's do one with an airborne foe priority, maybe? And do- hold on. 
Or ruin foe priority with a... I need missiles. He can't do missiles, but I'll do gravity shot. And then the second will be elemental weakness and then blizzard shot. And then I have no Valeriots though. But it could work. It could work. Okay. Changes its elemental affinity and weakness upon losing HP. Use different magic. Oh, okay. We'll see. We. Okay. But he's gonna be. Look at their little hats. He's got acid. He's doing gravity shots though. Dude, man needs to use. He. Elemental weakness priority. Oh, okay. It just took a second. Toxic deluge. Okay, fire. Let's do frost here. Frost. And then we'll save up, save up. It's brutal. Okay, we need barrier last use. Oh, gosh, I don't have any lariats. That's going to be really hard to take down. I mean, missile, maybe. I see the points at which he changes. See, I should have done Lariat. Oh. Oh, no. That's not good. See, I'm, I'm too far behind on my ATB. It's not ideal. Not ideal at all. And you get some damage in there. Go Frost. Get him, Fire! He's just smacking us. Okay, that's almost gonna be done. Wow, my fire shot guy is actually kind of doing it. Okay, they're moving in. Moving in. That's a king though, so I do want to be probably, probably want to get two. And then I actually think I'm gonna do portal skills, cautious courage right here. Mmm. I need to get a freeze over here. That guy is brutal. Uh, I feel like I wasted that, but maybe not. Maybe not. We'll see. We'll see. Hold on. I'm going to save. Hold on. I'm going to save. That needs to happen. That guy needs to go. He needs to go. Nice. Boss HP low. Hold on, we're gonna heal. No, not on one person. I can't heal on one person in good faith. That's too much. These hats are brutal. Come on, get in there. Okay, wait, wait, wait. Once those guys get closer, hold on. I can't get him. Oh, he's going down. Okay, hold on. Wait, let me go over here. I might regen, but I'm gonna, I'm gonna see. Okay, wait, hold on. That's a guy that's not really susceptible to anything necessarily. Mm. He's regening! He's regening! Okay, nice, nice. Pressure him! Full speed ahead! Pressure! <laughs> 30 seconds! Go, go, go! Go, go, go! 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 Missiles out! Missiles, everything! Go! Barrier, go! Do it! Ignore him! Who cares about his bite? 18 seconds! Go! Woo! <laughs> All right, let's go. Woo! We did it. We did it. That was awesome. That was fun. That, that, that was so fun. fun too. Yeah, this font's good to go. Man, this font. We really are dead weight, aren't we? No. Just slowing you down. You're the cheerleaders. Everybody needs them. Blessings of the planet be upon you. <laughs> <laughs> And what about you, my dear child? What truth have you to tell us this night? Really, guys? Me? You, a <laughs> resident gourmand. Come on, let's hear it. <laughs> <laughs> um, well, I 
guess so. Can't hear you. Uh, hmm. The, the truth is... The truth is, I just want to do more for you guys. I'm sick of feeling like dead weight around here. I just, I... For the love of God, not this again. Come on, out with it. Which one of us said that? Was it me? Biggs? Or was it... <laughs> no, nobody <laughs> said anything, honest. <laughs> you never would. You guys are too nice for that. You really think she's too nice? I'm nice to those who deserve it. Valid. <laughs> See? What did I tell you? <laughs> Uncle! Uncle! <laughs> <laughs> Seriously, we wouldn't be here without you. Huh. Was always down on himself. Yeah. Even though he shouldn't have been. Wedge worked harder than any of us. That's just who he was. Always trying to do better. Yeah. <laughs> he guy. was better. If only he'd stuck to looking after his cats and enjoying good food. <laughs> Let's go. I feel like I'm gonna think about him anytime I see a cat, though. Memories of the Fallen. I love this proto relic. This one feels so impactful and important, and <sighs> it's beautiful. Didn't think the little guy would be able to take down Fiend so easily, but after seeing what he can do, I'm glad he's on our side. Yeah. We're glad for the help, but it's starting to feel like we're the ones providing you support, or trying to. <laughs> I know my life has a purpose. But what? Okay, Paul, it's it's like not even 11 o'clock in the morning. It's too deep, too early for these deep kind of questions. I don't know. <laughs> you are asking important questions, though. These are valid questions, important, but it's too early for them. <laughs> Wedge. Wedge was always down on himself, but it's also what kept him always pushing and striving to be better. But it can, it, it's it's a hard place to be. It's not necessarily um, a good place to be because while I think you should always be striving for continual growth, if it's at the, you know, if it's to your own detriment or at the cost of your own confidence or uh, it's just such a, it's like anything in life, right? It's that balance between humility, confidence, being sure of yourself. Oh, wedge. Okay, we've got four more intel pieces, which should be pretty easy to do. I'm gonna actually pop out here and I will be right back. All right, let's get back into it. With our, we just cleaned this one. Yep, so we just need to do one last guy. I figure let's take a break from the proto relic. Uh, no, let's just go ahead and finish it because I do want to see. Yeah, I want to get back to some more of the other stories. Uh, let's go over here on Chocobo back. I want to finish out the stories with Wedge and all of them too. I think this is going to be by foot. No, that's a temple. No, 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 no. I think we actually are going. No, this is perfect. I think we need to go up this. That's weird. It didn't give me the option to go and chuck a bow back. Yeah, so this is in here. The life spring was here, but I think if we go all the way up here... Mm-hmm. We should be able to hop in a... Oh, we can't. Oh, I jumped down here, didn't I? How did I get there? That's the life spring. That's not what... Um... Maybe it was right here, actually. Hold on, go Chocobo back. I think this will... No, that will launch us down. We need to get up there, but that's not where we want to go, because that will be the life spring. We need to land up there. Some kind of landing system. Do I have a launch pad near here? May... Mm. See, like, this takes us exactly where we just were. 
That's the cave. We need to land right there. Okay, wait, maybe there's a small launch pad that I'm missing? Is there a launch pad right here? No. Are we able to get to it from, get past this stuff? Hmm. Oh, bunnies, bunnies, bunnies. <gasps> Hello. Good morning. Day number three after, you know, in recovery from this. Voice is still shoddy, but I will say that I feel like my nose is a lot better. <gasps> a tiny Bronco! Wait! Oh my gosh! Hold on. Inventory tiny Bronco. <laughs> Where is it? Where is it? Play Arts Fighter. I forgot about that. This Oh, the stuffed on Mary! The stuffed chocobo litter Oh my gosh. This oh the stuffed the stuffed chocobo. <coughs> Oh my gosh. Okay, I just said that I was feeling better. Here we go. Play Arts Tiny Bronco. How cute would it be? I'm sure somebody's already like getting these 3D printed. That is awesome. <laughs> the wheelie. The buggy. Okay, so let's figure this out. Hmm. Oh? Okay, wait, wait, this is good, this is good. This is exactly what we need. We go like this and we'll land on that. Oh, oh. Come on. And drop. Drop it like a top. Everybody lands at the same time. All right, move, move, move. Come Nothing down there. I'm glad we figured that out. More rabbits, more rabbits. Fake rabbits? Maybe I already got this? Maybe I already got them. I guess I never went up to the... F That's why. Because I'm in the wrong area still. I have to get up higher. I have to get up there. How the heck? Okay, wait, let's, let's just try going down here, actually. Okay, that's fine. That's fine, let's just try. Oh, he doesn't want to jump down for me. Okay, let's go the normal way. I'm sorry. Okay, so maybe I just need to keep running into the corner over there. I really didn't think that was... Nice. I really didn't think that was the same area. not gonna let me get past here this is mission related yeah these are all like mission related I think there's gonna be another way to get to that but I could try mm, I think I already did try didn't I uh, other ideas I could glide maybe from here I still need to get up here, too. There's actually, like, a whole area that I still need to get to. Mm. Including this, this fiend intel. Let me try. Oh, you want a chocobo? You know what? Let's glide over to that other side. That's how we're going to get to that fiend intel. I actually think I see them. Are those... No, maybe not. Um... No. <laughs> Gliding is not happening. Get out of here. Be gone. How am I supposed to get to the upper areas? I've got to fly there. Hmm. I'll try to go off-road here a little bit. There's a path. Okay, that, that's the path to the Fiend Intel. Maybe this swoops around and we can get to the Frodo Relic, too. We've been here for something. Whoa, wait. That's the Fiend Intel. Yeah, those guys are different. We've not seen those before. That is Fiend Intel, if I've ever seen. Yeah. Wizards of the Waste. Better not let your guard down. Stagger, Rare don't get petrified. 
commencing guidance protocol. As their name suggests, these Sawhagans are closely related to those found living in the sewers of Midgar. Though they have instead adapted mm. to the desert, they possess the same intelligence. We had seen them before. And have yeah. Been observed hunting in groups with their trademark tridents. Yes, their the teenage and carapaces are so tough that the warriors of Cosmo Canyon once fashioned them into shields. I would imagine those fiendish spikes offered them a measure of offense as well. Remember, the Sahagans have home field advantage. The Sahagans. So take care not to fall prey to their tactics. Best of luck. Yes, because I think we got petrified in the first time down in the sewers, right? All right, I'm going in prepared. So we're actually going to throw on. I have the assess materia, which is good, but I have somebody else who can assess. I think Barrett can assess right now. We're going to do something for anti. Let me see, anti. Um, not one of these. We should have something that ensures I can't get there. Grants immunity to petrifying stone. Boom. Done. Now that is with cloud specifically, but it's fine. Oh, 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 kitty wallop. All right, let's go ahead and use Barret first. Oh, sentient stone. Okay, we're gonna want to assess. Use cloud, freeze. Right, so we want my, we want, I almost said kitty kitty mew. Um, <laughs> we want Kate. Okay, so we're gonna want that blizzard to kind of spread across him. Oh, don't petrify. Nice. There we go. All right, let's get that nice staggered. Triple slash. Get back there. Get back there. Finish him off. Finish him off. Punisher mode. There we go. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Braver. Nice. Dead. Okay. Woo. Woo. Get out of here. Keep it together. I need to kitty wallop. Kitty wallop. All right, here we go. Let's do. We got this blizzard. We haven't turned a stone yet. Nice, nice. Let's do focus shot. Staggered. Overcharge. Braver. Boom. I know. I know. I know. I know. <laughs> Who is she? <coughs> I think it's like, this is one of my favorite combinations. Kate Sith for that magnify, that magnify freeze is incredible guys, like unreal. Uh, I know where that is, but I'm wondering if I can get to uh, uh, just amazing. Like that was so cool. This should take us where we need to go. Yes. No. No. Well, I can't exactly climb that thing. No. <laughs> I know. It's okay. We're going to go do this real quick anyway. We're going to go take out this one. And I do need to get to here. So let's go. Actually, let's go ahead and grab this too. I think the way to grab this one. Let me see if I choke a bow. Hmm. They are on an upper area. They're on an upper platform. They're right there. They're right there. Uh, I don't want to get hit by that. They're right there, right? Yeah. Oh, maybe I can go up and around. I feel like I'm just not expo- No. No, we've tried to do this. This is not the right way. Yeah, that's not it. This just takes you into a cave. So we need to find a way to fly up here. This thing. Probably this thing. Yep. And then if we land here. Wow. Yeah, if I land right there, I should be good. Get in there, get in there. Perfect. Right, this way should take us to it. Ah, uh, maybe. Is this... This is all explored. Maybe I saw them and I didn't fight them? Actually, just because I was near it, it might have explored it without me actually being up here. So that's probably, that's more likely, yeah. 
Guardian of Gold. Exploit the enemy's weakness and stagger an enemy. Oh, snap. Griffins are a union of bird and beast that soar through the skies on mighty wings and take down prey with sharp claws. These creatures have existed for eons and appeared in countless legends, yet have never undergone scientific study. Or perhaps those who tried fell prey to the beast's hallucinogens. Sightings of this variant are even rarer still, making this a golden opportunity. Remember, though, to keep an eye on those tail golden. as you proceed with your investigation. Okay, so we need to find its weakness, stagger, defeat, and a time limit. So actually, let's go ahead and go back to before I forget and I constantly have this, which is nice. Like, the anti-petrify is nice, but uh, what did he have before? I'm not even sure anymore. Auto life at the start that breaks upon use. I do like that. I like the concept of if I die, I can be revived. That... That could help me in some of the, some of the, um, ah, some of the arenas. Wait, that's actually really cool. Wow. Okay, can you help? Come on. All right, let me use Barret to assess. Okay, that's the Shirtle. They will eventually cast off their protective wind shrouds to send them hurling around a battlefield. At this point, they become, they will become pressured to cast off their protect. Okay. Ooh, we're getting out of that. Let me do a spells. Thunder. It's on you. There we go. That should work for exploiting. Nice. Now we just have to stagger. Get him, get him, build it up, build it up. Alright, let's go. Let's ride. Let's do Moogle Magic. Whoa. Keep building that. Overcharge. That Titan's coming in hot. Let's do focus shot. Oh. Ow. Oh, oh my gosh. That was bad. That was bad. He's easy to pressure now. He's easy to pressure. He's doing a focus shot. Hang back. We're always up in the air. Oh, I cannot get that. Come on, he's almost pressured. He's almost pressured. Ah, oh, he's almost pressured. Get him. There we go, Stagger. Take him down. You know, terrifying. Nice. Let's do. Let's ride. And then let's do a thunder. Hold on. I don't have thunder. Ah! Barrett always has thunder! What am I doing? What am I doing? Smackdown! Give him the smackdown! Braver. Oh, guys, I gotta heal. I gotta do some heals. Hold on. Actually, I'm gonna have to use a Mist Mega Potion because I just took too long. Alright, we'll get a prey going here in a second. Come on. To pray. My turn. 18 seconds! I forgot about the time! I forgot about the timer! I forgot about that! No! Wait! Ah! Ah! I got this. ATB boost, hold on, I forgot about it! Synergy! No! Thunder! I'm gonna have to go again. Oh my gosh! Oh. oh my gosh! That what was that? Like I didn't I need a replay on that. Was that two seconds left? I forgot I could completely forgot that the goal is to defeat him in the time limit. Very impressive work. You completed this region's combat assignments. Yeah. Such harsh environments as these are bound oh to my gosh. Brutal as their habitat. They it's my day. I need to use this while I have it. my informative and entertaining <laughs> guidance. Isn't that right, Chadley? The data we collected from the fiends you fought has helped us create a new combat Ugh. trial. I hope you'll find I it I need useful. to do all these combat trials. Oh, I no know. Army. I can hear y'all saying it. Mm -hmm. Okay, well, before we do that, let's take on the wyvern. But...
I need to get snappy stuff and we have all of our side missions. We've got a lot to do. So buckle up guys. We're not even close to being done with this video. All right. I don't know what I'm trying to do right now. Let's fly off the edge here and go this way. Da -da -da. The wyvern, then we'll finally be done with at least all of the battle intel. The battle intel is one of my probably least favorite right now. Probably. Okay, there should be like a cave around here somewhere. Oh, it's a little bit further. That's right, we saw it. Is it up here? No. What am I doing? I went way too far, guys. <laughs> Hold on. Run it back. There it is. Oh, I need to make sure everybody's healed up. I should have stopped at a... I should stop. Well, I guess Careful, I could heal up already. You have just entered Jabberwock territory. Jabberwock territory. Unfortunately, we know very little about this ending The Jabberwocky. Present, I suggest you expect the unexpected. This might help us with something we need for maybe one of the missions. Yeah. It's crazy how little the Junon region has, or maybe I didn't do, no, I did do all of it. Okay, does that not bother anybody else that all of them have this much and I do not, there's two missing in the Junon region? I know the region was smaller compared to everything else, but that bothers me. <laughs> oh no. All right, level 45, what level are we? We're level 40, guys. I don't know. We're level 40. Okay. Um, let me heal up and we'll just try our best. Try our best. Let's do a high potion on cloud. We'll do some ether. Mm. Items, ether. Another ether on Kate. And then I'll top up my health with another high potion. <sighs> okay, I'm gonna just drop a, a manual save here. Just to be safe. Oh, I don't know what to expect. I don't know what he's gonna be weak to either. I don't know if this is the best group for this. He's five levels ahead of us. I think I've always been higher than whatever we thought. Which tells me I didn't fight enough in this region. All right. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Let's ride. Holy cow. Holy cow. Ma'am, I could not hear you right now. Fire, a legendary dragon that sleeps at the bottom of the canyon. It is an unaging creature that has lived for eons, much like the minerals its bodily composition resembles. The surrounding ecosystem suffers grave damage every time it awakens from one of its long slumbers. Inflicting enough damage or exploiting its elemental weakness while Gorgon Shield is active will both pressure it. Okay. We gotta look for Gorgon Shield. Okay, keep it up, keep it up. The Jabberwocky. Seismic wave. Woo! Keep building that up. Get that focus thrust. Mount. Woo! Mount. Petrify. Nice. Let's do that Moogle magic, baby. Focus shot. Gorgon shield, we need to do a, 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 hold on. I gotta break it with a fire. I gotta break it with fire. ATB boost. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. There we go, there we go. Let's actually do a haste on Barret. And I'm gonna switch over. Uh, this is really strange for me. I, uh, Oh my gosh. Um, cure? I need a cure level two on Kate. What's wrong with Kate? Kate's stone right now. Okay, hold on. I need a heal. I need to anti-petrify. He got I didn't even know that he could be. 
I need a gold needle. Need my help, do you? Give him hell. I got this. Staggered. Nice. Go Get punish her mode. Break yourself. Keep it up. <laughs> okay, wait for him. I need to heal him real quick. Hold on. Items. Giga potion on Kate Sith. Okay, focus shot that. Focus. Thanks, my Gorgon shield, hold on. Fire. Petrification, get out of the way. Woo. Let's do Moogle magic again. Oh, ow. Oh, he is just tanking all of that. Let's go fire level three. Oh, I can't. Fire level two on him. Nice. Big pressure. Get in there. Keep it together. Stop strike. Seismic wave. Get out, get out, get out, get out. Oh. I just got tossed. Taken over. Let's go. Hold on. Synergy ability is let's do soldier moogle pups. Boom. Gorgeous. Leave it to me. Okay, for him, I need to get a heal going. He has Gorgon Shield happening. Let's go ahead and summon Ifrit against him. Finally, I can actually target using. Oh, I thought he had Titan on him. This whole time I thought I was summoning Titan when I was playing as him. Hold on. Let me do a heal, pray. Gorgon shield. Yeah, not doing too hot. Shake the heavens, that does not seem good at all. Hold on. Summon abilities, Crimson Dive! We're trying! Love this one. Let me see what I have. Synergy abilities. Nothing yet. Let me go Moogle magic. Oh, I do have Heat Wave as him. There we go, there we go, there we go, there we go. Staggered. Punisher mode. Oh, hey, that's cheating. Hold on. I have my limit. Let me go fire in the hole. Can we go braver? Come on, he's almost dead! Get him! No, I'm here for you! Finish him with braver! Woo! Cloud is level 41, Barrett's level 41, and everybody leveled up. Everybody leveled up. That was damn good. Let's go. So much XP, almost 5,000 XP. We've obtained invaluable intel. Yes! The study of such ancient creatures will surely provide insight into the region's history. <sighs> Hold on, All you ever care sure. about is your intel. It wouldn't kill you to show a little concern for Cloud's well-being, you know? You aren't hurt. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Are you, Cloud? <laughs> <laughs> you worry too much, Mai. Rest assured that I always... He always trusts us to win. I can tell at a glance if you have suffered any injuries. It's fair. In fact, Cloud... I guarantee that I know more about your physical condition than you do. That's it's a little alarming. That's rare material, Cloud. I suspect it will prove useful in crafting new creations. I suggest you hold on to it. What is it? I missed it. Hold on. One last one, and then Cosmo Canyon's done. But we have... Don't even worry. Like, that is... Like, we have so much left to do. But hold on. Wait. Um, what did I just pick up? Hmm. Let me see this. Um, MP up, HP up, good, good, good. Lightning, vitality up as well. AP up on fire and ice, it's getting close. It'll probably be maxed by the time we're done with all of this. All right, well, we don't need this level boost anymore because healing's maxed anyway. So I wish I had seen what it was. I wish it showed you what was new, it does. I think somehow it shows you what's new. Let me go through one by one and see. Healing, healing. Fire, fire and ice we have, lightning. So many lightning maxed. Winds, time, gravity, empowerment, fortification. 
Enervation. I don't use like any three of these, which I really should. AP up. Nope. Level boost. We've had. Magnify. Warding. HP absorption. It's not one of these. Enemy skill? No, it's not that. Prayer. Prayer is almost maxed. Well, almost is a. I don't know about that. ATB boost. HP up. Vitality, spirit. Is he talking about... Is he talking about the one that we get from something else? What? Auto weapon ability, maybe? No, I think I already had that on people. It, it's not a summon. I know it's not a summon. Okay, that's strange. Let me know. I must have missed it. I mean, I did, clearly, but like, maybe I was flipping through too fast. Okay, so how do we get here? Well, actually, I wonder... Wait a minute, let's go back to this Cosmo Canyon airstrip? I, th I think I might know. I might know. I'm a chocobo. Let's go this way. Wait, who's this for? Oh, is this the training course? Oh, snap. Well, we're doing this now. Apony. No matter where I go. Yes, Apony is the name of. Yes. You're Shani? You were talking with your mom earlier. I like how her clothes match. She's using the training facility she built. Figured if you're not up for it, then we could give Apony her exercise. Oh. No, don't. We'll bring her back. All right, it's settled. And Chocobo Whisperer Yuffie gets first dibs. Complete training course number one. Okay. In Glad de Chocobo, your goal is to earn points by passing through as many rings as possible before your talents touch the ground. Swift vertical mobility to reach high scoring rings. Swift vertical mobility. Okay. I guess let's do it. Wait, Crescent Sickle, you get a weapon from doing this too. Hell yeah. And this should be a pretty easy um, side mission to do. So I guess we're moving on to the side mission portions. Ooh, as Yuffie. All right. Some of these we might have to drop down for. But I, oh, look at that, see? We'll be able to go here, yeah, yeah, yeah. This is absolutely somewhere that we have a bed. Okay, we're gonna use some of these. I just don't know where the rings are. Woo, hold on, oh! Oh no, oh no. No! Okay, that's fine, that's fine. Oh no! Nope, 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 nope. I just, I shouldn't have let myself. I tried to, mm, mm, about that. <coughs> I'm sick, the sun was in my eyes. I just should have, yeah, that is what it is. Yeah, that whole area is somewhere I haven't been before. See, I think we should go over here. I think ignore that 100 points. I don't think I need it. Hold on, keep gliding, keep gliding. Okay, drop a little. Oh, there we go. It's scary. Okay, we need to go for this 300 point. Then it will launch us up. It's not too difficult, but it's just like taking control after you get launched up is my concern. Okay, launch me, launch me. There we go, nice, good glide, good glide. Here it is. I think you have to get all, all of the points probably to win. Oh, that was actually, I might've dropped too low. That's not good. Stay up, stay up, stay up, two 500s. 
Oh, see, oh no, I missed both of those. Oh, that is actually hard to get those two fight. Oh, but if you fall down into it, you drop down and you hit both of them. Okay. Okay, I think I got this. I think I got this. <laughs> you know, if I were racing at the gold saucer, I'd bet on me. Don't let it go to your head. I could do what you just did in my sleep. Before you start talking oh? big, you gotta at least finish the other regiments first. Oh. Gonna move the goalposts, huh? Fine. I'll take whatever you throw at me. Wait, I wanna go back to the other one. How to the next one? No, we gotta do this again. Oh, there's multiple training courses. Okay, I don't think they were expecting you to lose this bad. <laughs> we go again. Giddy up, girl! One more and I should be fine. I think I can do it now. I got almost all of them, so we'll do this. We just gotta get that hundred on the other side to max it. That hundred right there. It eludes me. So I gotta use yeah, I gotta use the up. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Use this to launch us through. Full speed ahead. Oh, take control, take control. Swoop it. Nice. Nice. All right, let's go down a little bit. Mmm. See, I'm letting myself glide too much. We need to do a little, like, kind of swing down, swing up, you know? Chocobo racing's easier than gliding. Perfect. This is the easiest course, too, and I can't do it. Okay, nice. Now we just need to fall on the 500 and we'll be good. Okay, glide. See, I didn't realize you could go down and up to kind of launch and like prolong your time in the skies a little bit. No! Oh, okay, ready, ready, ready. Hold on. Ready. Ready. Drop. You like that? Woo! And you did, in fact, need to have all of them. I think you had to have absolutely every single one to max. Maybe you needed 3,500. Wait. Okay, there it is. There it is. There's our new sickle. Nice. Okay. Let's go to... Not Tifa. Whoa. Yuffie. Birds of Prey, which is so good. Wait, but Crescent Sickle? 72.59. 46.89. And look at that. Another materia slot. HP up. What do I want to put on her? Does she have MP up? No, she doesn't. Let's do an MP up. I don't think I have any spare MP ups, though. Yeah. Steph last block. Mm. You know what I can put on her, though? Um, Autocast? No, I don't have any more Autocast. I have Warding. I have Congestion. Uh, morph. Enemy Scale. I'll just throw on Enemy Scale so we can start leveling that up, too, in case we ever use it. But let me do attack power, opening ATB, and limit break by 10%, maybe? Her limit break, oh, I think builds up pretty fast, just like whenever I'm using Kate. I feel like I build that up fairly quickly. So we need to go to combat settings, and I'm just, I know, I never use my different settings. I never use my different parties. I know that's driving y'all crazy, but I'll switch. I'll switch red for Yuffie, and then we'll do red as well, I guess, in party number three. Completed. But I can't use this course. Okay, let me see my chocobo. How do I get down there? You saw all of that, right? So I need to get down there somehow. Hmm. Maybe there is a launch pad that I missed? I'm sure that there's another one. Cause that, yeah, look at that. Penguins, no, get out, get out, get out. I don't wanna fight, I don't wanna fight. How? Mm. Jump down here. Can I jump down that? No, dang it. There's gotta be, oh, there's the jump. Hold on, right there. Yes, and then we come back over to Chocobo Ranch. Yes, here, 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 here. That's it, that's it. You know, is this a fast travel point? Not really. Well, you can go to Chadley here. I guess I could have gone here earlier. Okay, let's glide range and then go over to the side. There we go. 
And this should be a whole new area that we'll have to unlock some treasure for. Also, Cloud's health is really low. Okay, this was the thing that I saw when we were doing the race. The swoop race. Excuse me, excuse me. I know I need to finish the Proto Relic too, but I think this will take me to where I need to go. Actually, no, <laughs> not at all. Ah, uh, that's not true. Um, wait, there's one more chest around here. If I go the opposite direction, I might be able to. Let me see if I jump across here, if this takes me to... Okay, I'm still technically in the locate treasure area. It's not over here, it's probably on the back side. Because I've never been, I've, I've never been up top here, I've always been on the bottom. Yeah, there it is, to the right. I always think that I'm feeling better, and then I sit down to record and my voice is like, bleh. It just completely goes raspy. High Ether and Gale Swept Valley is a done. I guess I'll jump down right here, and then what we'll do is fast travel back to this now that we have this spot. We have this gliding spot. Yeah. So Snaps has his position over here, and then I'm going to see if we can do... Oh, I know how to get there. I know how to get there. Well, this is Snap's spot first, and I see it. It's on the back side. Here's our snappy spot. Perfect. All right, main menu, photo mode. All right, let's move up. Ah, oh, Cosmo Canyon. Uh, let me zoom in so clouds and also hide party. It's not the best time of the day. It's a little too, just kind of bright. I'm not liking the exposure on this. Okay, let's use a new frame. Oh, I don't have any more. Wait, there, I do. Cosmo stargazing. Filter. Let's see if there's anything good. Sunset? No. Retro? Cinematic? Melancholy? Celestial? <sighs> None of these are doing it for me. Costa? Corel? No filter. Let's make it darker. Camera position. I do like it being the center, but I don't like that rock over there, but I don't like that either. I wish we could have done it during this, like, sun, when the sky, uh, what am I trying to say? When the stars were out? I think that's as good as it's gonna get. I just don't like this time of day. It's too bright. Snappy. All right, so let's go back here on Chocobo, and then there's actually a path on the back side of this place, if you saw. So we go up, and up. Oh, okay, never mind. Let me go around this way. You know what? I should go ahead. No, I'm going to save my golden plumes, because you never know when you're going to find something else that you like better. I still have yet to buy the Shinra. Oh, shoot. This must be the next one, but I was going to use this to fly across. What? So then, wait a minute, if, how, mm, this is the perfect launch pad to take me over there. I'm trying to see anything that could launch us over. Okay, hold on, I'm gonna think about that for one second, I'm gonna run to the bathroom. That's so weird. There's gotta be another launch pad somewhere. Oh, do you see that one? Wait, see the one on the tippy tippy top? Let's try to go over there. Okay, I'll be right back. Hmm. What's directly across from me? This one? But it's actually beyond that. What I'm looking at is actually, like, right here. No. I think I'm actually looking even further. The ancient baths. I'm like, have I even been up on this? Okay, hold on. Hold on. I want that. I want that platform right there. This. Hmm. Look at right here. 
We're gonna test this. We need to go right there. See, look, 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 okay. So I need to get on top of this whole thing. So I have an idea. If I can launch up and then hit one of these, like right there, right there. Like right here. Oh, I'm not gonna be able to. Okay, hold on. Hold on. Okay, wait, 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 wait. New idea, launch from here. <laughs> All right, hold on, this will happen. Okay. I just have to make it to one of those platforms. I think I can hit that. I think I can do it. I see it. I see the, like, I see the glowing from where I need to go. I think I'm just barely going to miss it. So let me try to hit this one. I think this one's more manageable. I think they're the same distance. I'm kidding. I don't think they are. I don't know. I'm panicking. Come on. No. Hit it. Hit it. This is a sad day. This is a sad day. How? Are there ones that are closer? Okay, so wait, hold on. Okay, so new idea. New idea. Um, hit the closer ones. Maybe. Okay, hit those. Okay, if we go over here, look right there. Hit that one and then hit the ones across. Maybe. Okay. I think this is good. I still don't think I can make it over there, but I can certainly make it to this one. I don't know, because I took this direction, I feel like I could. No, no, I'm not gonna try, I'm not gonna try. Okay, launch me, launch me. Okay. No, it just like barely keeps you afloat. No, that's not gonna work. That's not gonna work either. Oh my gosh. Okay, wait, is it this platform? Is it this platform? Have I already been up there? <laughs> Is it this one? I'm on a chocobo. I'm on a chocobo. You're on a chocobo. <sighs> okay, what if it's this? What if I launch here? And I can get up on that. Maybe. We'll see. I think I can take that elevator, right? Surely. Don't call me Shirley. All right. Yes. 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 Here it is. Ruins elevator. Oh my goodness. But don't back up, don't back up. I just never went up here to these ruins. We're here. We are here. Finally. Here we go. Me trying every which way. Alright, let me switch to you. Yuffie. Oh man. Okay, what does she have? She has shooting star. On the skeet skeet. Oh. Okay. It's kind of cool. Kind of cool. <laughs> I should go ahead and heal myself, shouldn't I? Wow. That was good. All right, I'm not hopping on you yet because I think there's some more creatures to fight at every platform. Yeah. Oh, Kate would be so good with this. All right, let's go shoot at Star. All right, so we want to do our ice ninjutsu. Oh, he's going to come for me. Hold on. Hold up. Ice. Shoot. I need to turn on ice again. 
Hold on. Shuriken. Wild charge. Let's use ice. Blizzard level two on him. Nice. All right, switch to ice ninjutsu. There we go. Build up that weakness. Beautiful. Easy. Weaknesses. Build it up. Build it up. Build it up. Build it up. She's so good. It's like every time I switch to another character, I'm like, oh my gosh, I forgot that they're amazing. I love it. Okay, weapon is mastered. Ninja Bazooka. I like that. You know what? She can talk as much as she wants to because she smashes it when she's fighting. Also, let's see if we can transmute anything before we do this last battle. I'm excited for this mini game. And then that means it will make the way for us to do Chadley, side missions, all the things. Mm -mm. Okay, let's see. Let me bop this. I'm also trying not to make this video super, super long because since I don't have my full strength back, Font Shrine. It's a little bit harder for me to pull out five hour episodes <laughs> without making it like multiple days long. And I just, I don't want to, I thankfully I haven't had to dip into like a different game. Like a lot of times when I get sick, I have to pause whatever I'm playing. And then a lot of times it makes me have to upload something that I've already pre-recorded besides the main game that we're playing. <laughs> So I'm gonna see if we might stop after this. Well, let's see how it go. Font Shrine. I'd like to at least do some Chadley stuff. Mm -hmm. Here we go. The last phenomenon. This appears to be the fourth and final site. Once you've repaired the font and opened the altar, the proto-relic will be yours to claim, if my readings are correct. I've applied a final update to RoboChad, which should allow you to handle whatever comes your way. Oh no. New enemies. It's giving BD1. Gears and Gambits, baby. Let's do it. Final one. And final piece of intel for... Cosmo Canyon. Wow. Let's see. You can now set advanced actions detonated by plus, such as an augmentation or a shock. To program them, you must select one of the four additional conditions. These actions are extremely powerful, so be sure to program them to trigger at the best possible moment. Oh my gosh. Okay. I don't even... What? He now has a third option. Okay, so heal. Yeah, so we can get him to heal if an enemy falls below half. Let's do regen shots. Okay, and then that's none. And then for him... Gravity shot. For foe if they're airborne. Ooh, okay, I like shock. Survived 30 seconds, defeat one foe. Self, if your HP goes below 50%. Is this already my shock droid? This is, this is my shock droid. Currently targeted by two foes. I would say when we get below half, maybe. Okay, and then this is a blizzard and a gravity shot. We're actually... You know what, for airborne, that's good, but I don't want to do gravity. I want the, whoa, hyper. I can't do missile. Okay, I think that's fine. Airborne and gravity shot, we'll keep with that. We should be able to do a fourth. So let's do foe and then hyper lariat too. 
I don't know. Foe. Gravity shot. Because they're already doing... Yeah, they're already doing... Okay, we'll do a gravity shot there. And then this one, I can only do four. That's a heal, but we're actually going to do foe. Oh, I can only do shock. Wait. Okay. Let's keep it with the heal. With the regen shot. Okay. And then for portal skills, we're definitely keeping with the regen. And yeah. <sighs> this is going to be a loss. I don't know. I have to see. A lot of times I have to see what's on the field to begin with. Because they always use the same method, right? So like, we're going to do this guy here. But he's going to use the same. Oh. Interesting. So they have a shock if they go below half HP. Which is like a last ditch effort, I guess. Okay, we want to make sure we're not putting too many people in the area. So we're going to go ahead and, well, I need to see what he drops first. Okay, freeze. Let's do two freezes. Okay, we got two lightnings in the lane. That's beautiful. Dude, that guy's kicking their butt. Okay, so he just did a last ditch. I think he did a last ditch thunder shot, right? Gravity shot. Get him. Get him. What the heck is this freeze doing? Hold on. Defeat cure. Yellow marshmallow. Use thunder against robots weak to lightning and perform a special action. Wait, what? But it says... Wait, what? It says he's more susceptible to thunder than... Okay, I'm getting bopped, guys. Bopped. We have four in a lane, which we need to be careful about. I'm going to go ahead and do... Uh, use Blizzard. Okay, we'll see what happens here. I'm going to do portal skills here in a second. I have five in a lane, which isn't ideal. Okay, hold on. Let's do... Enhance attack power and defense. Go. Hold on. That is a... Use Blizzard against robots weak to ice. What? <coughs> okay, we're starting to do some serious damage over there. Let's do a portal heal here soon. Not yet, not yet. Heal. That might have been poor placement, but we'll see. I need the guys that do Lariat damage. Get that damage, get that damage. What? What's my Lariat? There we go, Hyper Lariat. Come on! We've got a minute. I don't think I can even kill him that fast to begin with. Move up, move up, move up. Do a... Do a... Missile. Phase shift, lightning! Oh no! Lightning, go! Boss HP low! Come on! I need to see these plans. What are these plans? I think I just need to throw out whatever I possibly can at this moment. That's a flan susceptible to... Maybe? Oh no! That's so many king flans, guys! It was a valiant effort, but not happening. Not happening. Oh my gosh. That's crazy. That's honestly insane how much damage they're doing. Go, go, go! You would need to have so many bots out on the table. Okay, he's killing him. I'm not gonna get it in the 15 seconds, but it was a nice effort. Honestly, it wasn't terrible. Not terrible. I don't know how I'm gonna use this situational shock thing. That was it, I'll take that. It was decent. So he drops a lot of flans, a lot of flans. I definitely don't wanna use my regen at that moment. If anything, I would do, we might need to be all out offensive, honestly. I would say all out offensive and then the cure shot, I just don't understand it. I don't even think it's worth it. I would say weak to an element. 
And I would do a Lariat and Hyper Lariat. I don't know. Regen Shot is not doing it for me. Let's do Foe Lariat. So let's make those guys a bit, yeah, able to help that. I don't like this self-healing thing. Let's do... Foe. I don't know. I feel like it probably should have heals in it, but I'm just going to send it and see. This is hard, mostly because I'm just not good at working against this. Okay, use fire against robots weak to fire. Perform a special action when certain conditions have been met. But I don't understand because it's... I thought it's saying that... So it's especially... Does this one? See, okay, hold on. He's doing fire attacks. And fire beats lightning. So do I not place lightning against that guy? Am I interpreting this completely wrong? Should I do a freeze here? Do I actually do a freeze? No, I don't think I meant to at all. Well, he's also doing gravity shots, to be fair. Yeah, it's definitely Thundershot. Okay, I'm gonna quit real quick because that was just a waste of a start. Okay, so let's retry. I, I'm telling you, like, the elemental guys are just so good. Okay, I'm gonna do... I'm gonna switch this. Priority should be foe weak to an element. This should be foe. This should be gravity shot. And then this should be blizzard shot. Okay. I think... I'm brute forcing it, and I'm okay with it. Get him. Get him. I was definitely conserving my ATB, which was good. I just... That wasn't it. Get the little guy. See, he's like especially... Use fire against robots weak to fire. Can only be targeted by actions like gravity shot and missiles while we're airborne. That's what, oh. Nice. Performs a special attack when conditions have been met. Okay, let's do another freeze here. We wanna just keep doing like two on one essentially. He just self-healed? Okay. Okay. Nice. Okay, we've got missiles kind of jumping out here. I'm gonna save that ATB. We've got Araga and Comet, but I'm gonna wait on that. We're definitely gonna want those offensives. So he's getting attacked by multiple sides. I'm still gonna wait because I want to keep this ATB as much as possible. Yeah, like here's a fire. We're just gonna do two fires right away. He goes straight for our stuff. Keep that ATB. That guy's doing a little self-heal. Beautiful. Minute 45 seconds. Good damage. Good damage on the board. Wait for him to try to play something. Okay, he's placed a fire here. This guy is going to be brutal because I have to shoot him out of the air. He was, in fact, not brutal. Fun fact, was not brutal. Okay, I'm gonna use this. Oh my gosh, wait, you zap your own characters? Wait, really? Really? Oh no, he's just doing a ton of damage. Okay, sir, 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 there's a, there's a, what is happening? Go hit this robot. What is happening? Go hit the, hit the flan. Hit the flan. Hit it. He healed too, by the way. What is happening right now? What is happening? 
Oh my gosh. We gotta go Comet. I gotta go Comet. Oh my gosh, this is insane. That one flan is just crushing them. This is gonna be so difficult. I was crushing that for a second. This is bananas. He's a healing so much. I just, I, there's no way. He's almost back to his full HP. What? This stupid flan is still alive. <laughs> Kill him. <laughs> Kill him. <coughs> Go! There's just no way. There's no way. That's insane. I, I don't think I'm having a bad strategy. I think that there's just a couple things that I'm going to have to do more. Okay. There's a couple things that we're going to have to add. I'm not understanding. Change order. Let's change order. Set recommended AI. I do want to just... Yeah, actually. Okay, see, that looks so much more intense than whatever I'm running. So we're going to save this and we're going to try with what they are recommending, okay? Okay. I just, okay. There's so many things about this game that I'm not understanding. And I accept it. All right, so. Faux shock. Bravery shot last use. We'll see if I can even use this in the same like way. See, now they're not targeting this big flan. See, that's not good. It's so weird. I mean, I guess it's still kind of working. They just, it just depends on what they're focusing on, like what their focus is. Okay. You know what? Maybe it's not the worst. You know, maybe it's not that bad. All right, he's using Blizzard. I'm gonna pop a creature over here just to do like a fire or something. Okay, this is good. This is good. Plus now they have like self heal. They can do all these kind of things. We just want to apply as much damage as possible. Probably save up that ATB, survive to 30 seconds. We're gonna go fire here. This is good. This is good. This is good. Survived 30 seconds. Augmentation. Okay, he's shifting to lightning. There's a lot of like things popping that I'm not used to seeing. I'm gonna go lightning. Currently targeted by four. Hold on, I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna do, let him drop real quick. Okay, hold on. I'm gonna do this. Just eliminate that real quick. And then we're gonna drop a lightning here. Okay, hold on. This is good. This is, no, he's regenning. He's regenning like crazy. I gotta go, I gotta drop it like it's hot. Hold on, go comment on these two. Get the comment, get the comment. Go fire here. We can do lightning here maybe. A minute recommended come on come on this is it this is it this is it Whoa! okay just go recommended ai if you don't know what you're doing and you're like me just go recommended ai it turns out better it turns out <laughs> not bad okay i see like i understand the concept of like if these certain things are met then they pop a heal if they survive for this long i understand that i think i just knowing that we were only gonna play it four times i maybe just didn't give it the patience that it deserved oh, oh. when i die will i return to the live stream too mm. given what i am Well, yeah. Why wouldn't you? He's a creation oh. of Shinra. 
He's starting to question his existence. It's interesting. What's that? A gift Wedge left behind for us. Listen, I just... Uh, and I want to say thanks. You all being here, it helped. Uh. Oh, we, we didn't really do anything. Now that the ruins are fixed, what's next? Actually, I was wondering if maybe we could join up with you guys? Yeah. Wait, you can't yeah. be serious. Think about it. We haven't heard Jack from HQ, but these guys are out there making a difference. Uh, I know, but... What do you say? We'd be happy to tag along if, uh... And who the hell said you could? <laughs> People not willing to die for the cause got no place with us. Uh, I'm sorry. I just thought that... Your hearts are in the right place. But y'all... Y'all got a different path to walk. Yeah. One Look at Aerith in the background over there. All your own. Yeah. Man, I can't eat another bite. <laughs> <clears throat> I suppose it's time for yours truly to say his piece. Here it comes, the grand finale. May the planet guide your words. <laughs> Let's hear it. And keep them brief while she's at it. <laughs> <clears throat> they loved Jesse. So, the five of us here all came together because we wanted to save this planet of ours. Ain't made much money. Ain't made a lot of friends either. But that's not a lot of friends. We do have deep in our hearts is a passion. A I know what he means. That burns for the cause. That won't stop burning till Shinra goes up in smoke. The road ahead won't be easy. <laughs> Wait. But I ain't stopping. Cause even if it costs me my life, uh, I'm taking down Shinra uh -huh. and taking back our planet. No. Uh. So if you got the guts, then come with me. <sighs> I'm hungry after all for justice. <laughs> I. Right. You know I'm in. My man. Well, if everyone's feeling it, how about we keep things going with another round? <laughs> Tifa, get me another Cosmo Canyon. Sure. Make it fun. <laughs> this proto relic felt super special, obviously, because it brings in and ties together our past. Um, but yeah, I really liked this one, probably more than the other ones. Tifa. Hmm? This isn't what they'd want for us. Now, I'm not saying we should forget about them. No way I ever could. Yeah. But you and me, we gotta stop living in guilt and regret. Yeah. Hmm. Barrett's one of, I think, the most influential. Oh, oh, oh. No. <laughs> they finally made it to Cosmo Canyon. They also don't know at this point that Biggs is alive. <laughs> Today's a new day, people. So let's not waste it. Come on, y'all. Come on, y'all. Come on. Ah, come on with the come on. Hey, Look. Wait. Forgot this. Oh yeah, the proto relic. Here. And we got to see some people from the DLC. That was incredible. We also did complete all things Cosmo Canyon. Cosmo Canyon's like a larger part of the, I think the game too. Like there's a lot to do here. We still need to finish the, oh, here we go. The gambit paid off. 
Yeah, Barrett is such an influential character, especially in the group. He really is kind of like the... Here we go again. I think he's the part... He's the pin that points north on the Just compass for up. them, you know? The proto relics staying with me. Ha! Silence! You caught me unawares once, but it will not happen again! <laughs> Ooh, Burning those thingies. To reclaim my stolen prize. Rages evermore. That Look at his face! Taken, shall be returned! Oh, we're actually doing this. We're actually doing it. Oh my gosh. Okay, here's the thing is I'm not used to, whoa, 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 whoa. I'm not used to, uh, not used to. Oh, what? I blocked that. I was trying to block it. Ow. Ow. Okay, I'm getting my butt kicked. It's this is like, home. what is this freaking? This is like Sekiro. Yeah. Oh, ow! Never again. Oh. Now. Oh. Dual thrust, dual thrust. This feels like a Souls game all of a sudden. Second wind. Oh. Oh. Okay, what's he gonna do? What's he gonna do? Dual thrust? There we go. Okay, so he's susceptible after he does so. Oh, wow. There we go. Look, he's on his toe. Let him jump again. Dual thrust. Helm splitter. Okay, it's actually not too, too hard. We just have to dodge. Sweep. Oh, okay, that's not great. Yeah, so he normally does like a pose of some sort. Now look, look, look. Brace yourself. Oh, I should have done a thrust right there. Ah! Curious pose? There we go, gorgeous. All right, we want to get a heal real quick. I'm just going to go item. It's about the long game, y'all, long game. Just build it up, build it up. Helm splitter. Roll behind him. Get that souls roll, souls roll. He should do curious pose. Stagger. Tis but a scratch. ATB boost. Punisher. Boom. All right, half HP. Nice. All right, here we go. A Grandings. Oh, uh, that doesn't look good. Oh, I should assess him, shouldn't I? Wait, I don't have assess on anymore. That's not great. Oh, that's not great. Ow. More like dome splitter. Jeez. I'm gonna try something. I don't know. I'm gonna try like thunder. Calling lightning. <laughs> oh. All right, look here, buddy. Uh oh. Hot splitter. Curious pose. Okay, I need to heal real quick. Hold on. Let me use a mega potion. Come on. I mean, I'm just I'm not blocking a lot of stuff, but Come on. Pinwheel. I, I should have blocked that. I should have been able to block that. I've almost got limit. Dual thrust. I need to stop bravery because it's just not doing anything. Curious pose. It's on now. Gorgeous. Retreating sweep, followed by, whoa, followed by immune pressure. It's a fun fight. Oh, I should have blocked that. Okay, I'm gonna be able to limit when he. Try this. Staggered. Limit him. Crisscross slash. Let's finish this. Boom. 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 Nice. I had to channel my souls times for a second there, but I needed to be able to parry more. I just have to block. Without the power of Genji, I am out, Genji. Oh. I still haven't gotten a new blade for a while. 
The mere sight of it has kindled in me a covetous desire. Could it be that hunger for weapons brought me hither? Wherefore Is he trapped too? Elude me? Return what you have stolen! My Genji! Give it back! Oh! <laughs> Stand and deliver. Halt, I say. Let it go. I'm not until you return. What is mine? There's a lot more to start. You're right. Look, there's a buster. I didn't oh even see God. the makeshift buster sword Come on his back. Man. Oh my gosh. Only then shall you know peace, but not until that day. <laughs> oh, that was creepy and scary, and I don't like that at all. Yeah, he had a, like, smorgasbord of weapons on his back, and I guess in all of his hands. There is more to this story, absolutely. I think we have one more area of proto relics, right? He is also trapped. Time, he was seeking the proto relics in order to restore his lost memories and make himself whole. Guess so. Wait, so what exactly are the proto relics? It is, of course, too early to say anything for certain. But I suspect they may be some manner of armaments. armaments formed from matter not normally present in this dimension. If we assume the giant was also from another dimension, then there is a possibility that he was the original owner of the proto relics. Mm. Wait, so. If they are his, does that mean we should give them back? Given the phenomena he has been able to conjure in this dimension without the proto relics on hand, I shudder to think yeah. what havoc he might wreak yeah. for his powers fully restored. It might be prudent for us to gather a bit more information on the proto relics before we decide to return them. For now, I propose that we retrieve the artifacts and perform a thorough analysis. But he needs to tell me to go back and retrieve the other ones. Inspired by your proficient programming, Chadley has made some adjustments to the game that has offered an increased challenge. <laughs> no, thank you. No! Cosmo Canyon, complete the Gears and Gambits hard mode! <laughs> no! 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 I don't want to! Oh, gosh. Oh, you guys know I'm going to, though. You know I'm going to! I don't want to, but I'm going to. We also still need to go back and play Queen's Blood. Gosh, there's just so many games. So many games are popping up. <laughs> okay, um, we do have a lot to do, but in light of the fact that I'm still recovering from being sick, I think I'm going to stop the episode here. Um, I told you guys I'm kind of like, I'm pretty much just on par with y'all. I'm just barely getting these videos recorded because I lost so much time. <coughs> I'm just barely getting these to you guys. So normally I probably would do all of the side missions and also do some Chadley time in this episode, but I just want to make sure that I'm able to bring you guys content every single Tuesday, Thursday, Saturday as much and to the best of my abilities as possible. So this was all things Cosmo Canyon region Intel. We obviously have a couple extra things that we're going to need to do. Um, but we'll pick back up next episode. We'll start with doing side missions in Cosmo Canyon and Chadley, 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 Chadley. I, it might be a whole episode dedicated to Chadley, but I really do want to make sure we're doing all of those summons and everything. Um, and yeah, I just, I just want to make sure before we move on to Niflheim that we really have completed as much as possible. It is important to realize that there's only three side missions anyway. And I haven't finished any. I didn't kick any of the butt in. Oh gosh. Also, Karel, he still hasn't given us, I'm assuming that this is maybe where we go back to. This might be the ending, the ending for the Proto Relic situation, because we still have two pieces of Proto Relic left there that we just never gained access to because it's not popping up on the map anymore. So yeah. So that was a lot of Cosmo Canyon done. I guess Niflheim is up here, isn't it? Niflheim must be where this other cloud coverage is. That's going to be so cool. All right. Well, I will see you guys in the next episode for some Chadley, Chad McMore, some Chadley and side mission time guys thank you so much for tuning in today i hope you guys enjoyed this um 
I talk about it, I feel like at the end of every single, every single kind of section and intel gathering session we have, but I just think it's so important for me to experience as much as possible that the game has to offer. Because as you guys know, in light of what I do, it's a little bit difficult for me to justify doing a second or third playthrough so quickly after doing a first playthrough. So very often I'm trying to complete as much as possible in that first go. Um, and also just because it's the type of player I am. I want to see everything that they have to offer, um, which I know is never possible in just one playthrough, but it's cool to get to see all the side quests and just do as much as you think you you've discovered and you can do while we have it. But all right, we have a bunch of mission boards. We'll go collect those. We'll also go reclaim my pride that's smeared all over the floor by these people. So yeah, I will see you guys in the next episode. Thank you so much for all the support and yeah, bye.